Hey yourself. Hello and welcome back to the stream. Hello, Darth Faison. How are you? Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. There we are. So. Do a little bit warming up today. We're going to be covering some Lux Spheres and see... See what we can get done with the Lux Spheres. Let me see. Do I have my handy dandy notebook up? I need to figure out who do I... I need Fortune Spheres first. Because I want to fill out the grid. I, I feel it's more advantageous to fill out all these ones that have, like, you know, the, li the little ones there. We'll fill those out. So that's Fortune Spheres. They say to beat the shit out of that is Earth Eater. And a lot of people bitch about Earth Eater. Still cooling off to that disaster of a stream I went through earlier. Today? You stream today? Am I following you? I don't know if I'm following you, Darth Faison. Let me check. Not to say that um, Twitch does a good job of notifying anyone of anything. I'm not following you. Let's fix that. Done. But what happened? Why did stream not go so good? Uh, that's up, that's up, that's up. Okay. Earth Eater. Yes. Yeah, so what happened with the, the stream then? Yes, we turn to main menu. Alright, let me talk to this dude and get to uh, buy some more Phoenix Downs, I guess. Hopefully I won't have to buy anything else. Oh, I'm 65, holy shit. Okay. Oh, I sold a crap ton of stuff, that's why. That's why I have all the monies. Uh, Earth Eater, Earth Eater. Let's crank up this bitch. Buy monsters. Well, let's say I hit a fever pitch pretty early on and it infuriated me enough to stop stream early and delete the VOD. Hmm. Technical issues? Or gaming issues? If it's technical issues, I understand that. Uh, Earth? Earth Eater, there we go. He's 15,000 to fight. What a dick. Waka, 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 waka! Yeah, I don't think his hits are as hard as the slice and dice. Eat it! That's a, it's a cool design, at least. He's got that, like, split jaw and the two tongues. It's creepy. At least we're so fucking fast now, this is taking no time whatsoever. Alright, take your time. Take your time. Boom, boom. Now that I'm taking my time, it works better. Waka 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 waka. Uh, incidentally, I'm also canceling my Mario Odyssey playthrough. I need to just stay away from the platforms. Is that what happened? We, we was it, you were having issues playing the game? I mean, sometimes you get you gotta like warm up to it and kind of get into it. Hello, Chocobo enthusiast. Why are you an angry boyd? Why, why are you an angry boyd? What's wrong? This guy will just hit us for every single thing we got here. Shell. Magic, and then everyone's got good magic, so we should be able to heal each other really well. Beautiful heal. There we go. Alright, we're good to go. 
Oh, do a quick hit. Which is... Uh, skill? Quick hit. There we go. Skill. Quick hit. I think this is a thousand. Yeah. Skill. Quick hit. Yeah, now that he's knocked on his ass, this is what we're going to be doing, I guess. I guess I could just let this play out. Oh, that's not too bad. And then he shit himself. Help, I fall and I can't get up. Yeah. After he falls over, he just starts casting magic. That's all he does. He's an angry, angry boy. Okay, and all of that gives me two fortune spheres. And how many does that give me then? It's not a lot. Um, how many do I have total fortune spheres? I have four. Every single character. How many luck nodes are available? It looks like one. Oh god, they're hidden. It's gonna be hard to find. One. Two, three, four, five. This is only for six. This is only for Titus. Seven, maybe? Seven? Which that means seven times three for how many I would need to clear out those for everyone. God, this sounds painful. I hate that he casts fire from his ass. Flare. Flare from his ass. It's different. Flare's non-elemental, right? Does Shell even block that, or have I been wasting my time? Let's go over here, then. Since we're about there. And move everyone in this area here. So we can all benefit from... Getting some luck. Okay, Fortune Sphere. Nope. Fortune Sphere. Fortune Sphere. Now, how many other spheres do I have? The, the, what are they called? Lux Spheres? Lux Sphere. I have three. So I can actually. Get these two here. Okay. And each time you level that up, that's four points. Four points of luck. So Titus is 24, 22, 23. Now they say you don't necessarily absolutely need all the luck for the final final bosses. But I'm gonna try to try my best anyway. Try to at least get it maybe into the hundreds. We'll see. Um, no, original? Yeah, Earth Eater. 15,000 to fight this goober. This big fat goober. Who is fat? Hello, Black Hat. How are you tonight? Quick hit. Wow. What a dick. What an absolute prick. Skill. Quick hit. Oh. Well. So the thing that's goofy about that... Fuck it, let's see. How much damage does he do when he casts that? That's 2,000. Okay, so maybe Shell is worth it. Black magic, white magic. Shell, 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 shell. Shell, shell, shell. Flat. Yeah, I did cut it down. Okay.
this point, we just slap the bitch out of him. Slap my bitch up. Slap my bitch up. Everyone, ever, oh shit. Everyone remember that, um, from the Matrix? Oh, I don't think I cast shell on her. Or does she have shell? She doesn't. That's probably why she's taking more damage then. Flap. Slap. Sword play. Let's do slice and dice. I think slice and dice actually will do more damage. Because each one is like 20k. Almost 30. Each one. 3, 4, 5, 6. He's dead. Is that monster getting raped or having a nightmare? Yes. Also, hello and welcome to everyone. I hope you're having a good Thursday. A Thursday. A good Thursday. Happy good Thursday. Maybe that's why they say this one's a pain in the ass to fight, is because he's so damn expensive. But at least with everything leveled up the way it is, he's not that hard to find. Okay, so who's my I said I'm working a 12 hour shift. Oh, did you? I'm sorry, I didn't see that. 12 hour shift. Isn't that less than what you've usually usually been doing? It started two hours ago, right. No, not on you, Dingus. Slap. That's his turn. That's his turn. His turn is to just keep casting that bullshit. Bonk. Bonk. Maybe they hate this because you can't go as fast. I fall in. Hello, Viper. How are you? Two more fortune spheres. Good. Let's exit. So where we are right here, use fortune sphere. Fortune sphere. You now use fortune sphere. Fortune sphere. Grind out another two. Which, okay, so what are they at now? Damn. Okay. I'm wondering if I'll need I'll need more luck on Riku if I can get Riku's up and running. My coworker that relieved me this morning at eight o'clock was looking a little pale and already sick from mild flu slash mild cold. Oh no. He was supposed to work a sixteen hour double. No. But I offered to come in four hours early if he couldn't make to midnight. Oh, thank you. So he called me after three this afternoon to let me know to come in early. And now here I am. Oh, okay. Coffee, cool face, nerd face. Hey, if you get paid for it, then, you know, good stuff. That means two years and eight... Wait, huh? It... Hold up. It's Mickey's second birthday. 
That means two years and nine months ago, Mama got some. Who's Mickey? Your son. Oh, okay. Why do you. Why would you. Why would you keep math on that? Actually, I'm not surprised. It's, it's you, Viper. Why wouldn't you? Why would you keep, like, conception dates in mind? Seems a little weird. Seems a little sus. Now you can just beat the shit out. Why does he keep hitting Waka? Okay. You bitch. Right out of his asshole, too. Oh, okay, because it's funny. I love typing that out. I can't help it if you all think it. That's you all don't think that's hilarious. Is your youngest always going to be your youngest, or is there plans to make your youngest not the youngest? She's fixed. We can get down without her. I hope everything went okay with that surgery, because they usually say that uh, it's more of a pain for women. Allegedly. How? Why would some jackass add an achievement for this where you have to fill out every single one of these nodes? That's just awful. I guess I could do it. There's some that are easy to farm, but... Holy shit. So, how many Lux Spheres can I get? Out of... Well, Tidus already has that one bought. Not have it yet, so we'll fight that guy again. And again and again and again. Clap. Clap. Now he's down. Seven minutes. Shell. Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you. Meh. Seven. Meh. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, I'm gonna show you. Cheese. Maybe 
got in trouble and they did an emergency C-section, so while they had the cavity open, they- Oh, oh! Yank the uterus out, tie, cut, and burn them to- Oh my god. Literally scorched earth. Jesus Christ. Theoretically, I could still make it. Okay, all right. Keep it in your pants. It would require a different iron? Why would it require a different iron? Oh. Finish spelling. I thought you were being cheeky. A female. Okay, so each... Uh, that was the one I probably bought. So they're each on the same level. So now I need to just get more stuff. So the Sphere Goober is the guy that I need to go to to get more Sphere... that Lux Spheres. What was he? Greater Sphere? Let's see if we can beat this guy. They're both so expensive. Effie is Latin short for iron. I know. That's why I said it. I know my periodic table-ish. You know, the M and send button are within thumbs width. Oh, they are. Hello, cover the flamingo. Well played, Uncle Cheesy. Not just a hat rack, my friend. It's also filled with nerd trivia that is completely fucking useless. Hey, guys and dudes. <laughs> Flam thrower. <laughs> Dang. 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 I've never fought this guy on a long fight before, so let's see if I can get all my guys uh, auto wiped up and see what he does. Okay. So, what happens if I bonk? Oh, that's right. It does a full. It does a full fuck you cast. Okay, so let's do shell. Maybe that'll reduce things a bit more. Okay, slap. Yeah. Every single... Every single one is, is that. Okay, slots. Attack. If I need your body, I'll... Fuck it. Dick. Why do you come... Welcome. In 2077, what makes someone crazy? This isn't too bad. In Night City, you can become. Oh. That's a little fucking stupid. Okay. Going a little nutso on me, boyo. Slap. Yeah, every every attack does Ultima. This is so stupid. How much health do you have? There we go. And this will give me like one Lux here. It's not that difficult. But they're right, the comments online are right, it does take longer to do. Versus a lot of the other ones where you just like, just attack them and then you get stuck. Grind. Grinding and farming. Whetstone Chocolate Company? I don't think I've ever heard of them. Two Lux Spheres. If I have two Lux Spheres, how many Lux Spheres do I have? Three. I can use them over there. Move over there then. 
I got everyone here in that, okay. So we're all the way here. To get four more. Maybe a dick bag and a half. Boy, it was one of my favorite cities to visit. Really? St. Augustine? I, I don't think I've ever been there. I've never heard of them either, but it seems worth looking into. Right. It's local to St. Augustine. Ah, okay. Fun fact, you can have adult time in the fort. Why are you here? Who let you out of your cage? It's the oldest city in the U.S. Really? St. Augustine? Who said that? Is there proof of that? My dad scored some mint chocolate shells and he loved them. I do, I do. I'm a big fan of mint chocolate. Some people hate mint ice cream or any sort of dessert. Because they're like, it reminds me of toothpaste and toothpaste is to clean your teeth. I'm like, eh, it's okay. It is the oldest city. Really? You'd think somewhere in Virginia would be the oldest city or something. Guess it ain't. Okay, let's go. Let's go. So now I just need a crap ton of fortune spheres. Hooray. Uh, let me see if I can sell more garbage. Fifteen thirty? Is that the year? Well, that has auto phoenix on it already. It's only three for it though. Triple overdrive. Triple overdrive. Oh, with th oh, auto potion. Triple overdrive. What am I getting these from? Holy shit! Magic booster. Don't know. Yeah, this is getting me a lot of money. So at least that's something. So I just cleared out all the stuff there. Hey, Sophie! What's going on here? Hey, Coraline! Hello! Happy Thursday to you. I've been sending you pictures, particularly your flag... Flagler? Flagler. I like the fort. I think I did see the fort. The fort looked cool. Old forts are always kind of cool. 1565. Did you go on the tour? Did they... Did they edumacate you? What you working on now? Luck. Luck spheres. I'm gonna try to see if I can at least get luck up to a hundred and see how painful as that is. And if it's too, I'm just. I am going to tackle, or at least try to tackle, Dark Bahama tonight. Right now, I'm just selling shit. So I can have more monies because these monsters I'm fighting are fucking expensive. All right, let me do a save here. So which one I gotta fight? I gotta fight the Earth douche to get more luck. Fortune spheres. Waka 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 waka. Start off by casting Auto Life on everyone. And then... Slice it. Pretty sure this does more damage. 
two, three, four, ooh, five, six. And because of that, that did crit damage. All about that crit. About that crit. All damage. This is the second tour I've gone on. My mom and dad went to experience it all. Tour is the best way for a to Tours are, can be really cool. But I googled that answer. Oh. Are you going to play Rock Breaker with Steve on Saturday, Coraline? I don't know if I'm going to be doing Deep Rock Galactic on Saturday. But, maybe. Because, uh... They just announced that the, the demo for Resident Evil 4 is out. So I'm wondering if I should stream that. I try to see if my computer can handle it. Biff. Waka. This is randomized who he attacks. Weird. Whatever. Everyone's generating more stuff. Uh, got my motherboard in tonight. Got everything to start building, but I'm trying to see if I need to get a grounding strap. You don't absolutely need to. It's just kind of a thing to, like, cautiously have. I have a carpeted room, but I'm building on my desk. I could obviously build it in my on my kitchen table. I just don't want to wait for a grounding strap to get here. You don't need to. It's just kind of like, if you have the concern, if you want to be extra safe then yes, the grounding strip is, is cheap, easy recommendation. But like we said before, just if you maintain touching the, the frame of the case, which is metal, that'll ground you. Because that's that's what you use. Usually when you have the grounding strip, you'll, you'll wrap it around your wrist or something, and then you attach the other end to the frame of the case. Well, if you're constantly touching it, it should be fine. You're just getting rid of all that charge. just started just ground yourself to the case. Right. I'm not on his level. It's fine. I'm most... Uh, you'll be fine. We're mostly just, like, dicking around. We're not... We're not really vamping up the difficulty. I'm still trying to collect all the weapons in the game, in which case you can just crank down the difficulty and finish missions. This a really nice guy. Stop selling it. Now it makes it sound like there's something wrong with me, Viper. When you say that, what exactly do you mean? I just want to make sure I'm getting it right. So, so, so say, say this is your case. Say this is your computer case. So, you touch it. <laughs> that's, that's all. So if you're, you know, you could just kind of like, place your hands on it, that discharges it, and then like, pick up a piece, a motherboard or something, and then put that in there. And then, you know, touch it again. It, that's about it. That's, that's all it is. Like, unless you're really, like, moving around a lot, you don't need to worry. I usually like to use one just for extra, if I'm being really paranoid about something, if something's really expensive, and I don't want to take any chances, I'll do that. But most pieces, like we discussed yesterday, it's like they're shielded in a way. It's just, you build up static discharge all the time just through normal things. You know in the wintertime, you'll, you'll touch something metal and you, you get that little shock? That's basically what it is. You just grounded yourself. Well... Depending upon if if there's a lot of humidity, if it's too dry, or something like that, it can futz with your your staticness. But just touching the tower should be enough to like discharge. You're you're grounded. Good. You're not going to take that little spark and put it on a uh, a component of whatever circuitry you're working with. Yeah, there's a metal case. Just touch it. Waka sigil is making me pissed. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty bad. Because the thing is, is you have to have Waka in a certain amount of fights before it procs. It's it's the dumbest thing. Now, I lucked out and it was, and then there's like a random chance of it dropping. It's There's so many things that are just like wasting more time. Dry west or wet east? Oh, are you in the dry north or the wet south? What the fuck? Viper, shush. You're not making any sense. Sit down. Uh, that gets you in the case in the same potential. Right. No moonwalking while doing it. What? 
I'm going to bed. I'm tired. Okay, have a good night, Flamingo. Thank you for stopping by. I use them because of the navy. Just wanted to say hi. Night. Not Cora. Flamingo. Covert. I was the ESD program manager in one of my shops. What was that like? Which shop? Navy shop? It's the only thing I need to complete the weapons. Oh man, when you get all the celestial weapons, I've been riding on the celestial weapons the entire game. Hello, hot dog, raw dog. How are you? Did you see those images I posted in your Gilded about uh, Psycho Stick? That they have one of the guys that they work with is like a he he has a hot dog like emote uh, a face. What is it called? Fuck. Filter. He has a hot dog filter on, and so he's always talking and stuff. It's it's so good. It's so good. I love it. They are also fans of the hot dog. Hot dog. I'm doing well. Right now we're grinding- Oh fuck. Well, that's dark matter. We are grinding out, um, luck. Now. For instance. Not for instance. If I can get enough dark matter... What I'll do is I will create a... I'll make sure I create a ribbon on somebody's something. 77. We're almost there. Seven. Seven. Because I can create it on, like, Waka. I think the best ones would be, would be like, Tidus and Waka, maybe? Because I'll be able to... I'll, I can use those in future... On, on those water levels. I want to put one on Yuna. I want Yuna to have a ribbon. Because she can pull out her summon to take... Uh, like a, a hit, an attack that would wipe the team. And that's the one she's missing. She's also missing auto-protect. I'm not sure. Eh, eh, eh. We'll see. Uh, it was an ordnance shop, but we worked with M299 power supplies and PCMs. Nice. Happy the bull zone. They haven't checked Gilda yet. Okay, no rush. I just thought it was kind of funny. If you're familiar with Psycho Stick... They have the Would You Like a Taco, and uh, Opie doesn't like that song, because he's like, they eat the taco and it's disgusting. And I'm like, yeah, it's true. Uh, what other songs do they have? Beer is good. I like boobs. That's another one of the songs they have. Very classic. Classic band. Text Giba? Why are you texting Giba? Why you text the Dagiba? No need to text the Dagiba. Why am I talking like that? And knock him on his ass. Mama say knock you out. And then I just cast shell on everyone, I guess. And then we started the bonkings. Bonk. 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 Right in the dick. Like I said before, I kind of want to get luck up to like maybe a hundred, and then I'll tackle Bahamut, and we'll see how bad we do. Because Giba like my wiener. I'm sorry, that's right. I've summoned the wiener word. Wiener worshipper. You love a da wiener. Everybody love a da wiener. Guys, guess what? I had some cottage cheese today. Because <laughs> we were talking about so much cottage cheese. I had cottage cheese, but I made, made specific purpose. I'm like, I gotta have this cottage cheese. Because we were talking about cottage cheese last night. And I need some cottage cheese. The one that I really enjoy. Yuck! What's wrong with cottage cheese? What's wrong with your face? Nothing wrong with cottage cheese. Well, it de I, to be to be honest, it also depends on the type of cottage cheese. Uh, the type I have is actually this this one batch is really good. Every now and then they just they're not as good. But um, if it's four percent milk fat, it's really good. Or 
shop. There's shop. Okay. Yeah, the 4% milk fat is like the sweet spot, and it's really good. Really good stuff. Bob. Wait, are you not? You're not maxed yet. Bob. Cheetahs is... Slice and dice. Bonk. Killed half a bucket. Jeez, you actually ate a, a form of cheese today? Don't sound so surprised. I just got done eating some pizza. What kind? What kind of pizza does the hot dog like? We talking thin crust? Pan style? What kind of toppings? Pepperoni? You can't... You can't... It is a law of this chat that you can't just say you ate some pizza without describing what the pizza was. Because in my head, it's anything from, like, the best pizza imaginable to some frozen pizza shit DiGiorno crap. I need to live through... I need to eat vicariously through people. Shut up, Viper. That, that doesn't sound how you think it does. Four percent is best girl? What the hell does that mean? I would take crackers and cheese, not cottage cheese. Okay. I mean, I guess it's still cheese. Uh, we had Buffalo Wild Wings last night. Nice. They used to have a, a steak wrap that I really enjoyed, and they got rid of it, and now I'm sad, and that's my story. Does anyone know how much Blue Eyes White Dragon trades for? What, on the on the dark, the dark Yu-Gi-Oh market? Crackers and cottage cheese. Still works. Although, Sophie knows how to satisfy the tummy. What does that mean? What kind of kinky things are you getting into, Gina? And Sophie. Do buffaloes have wings? I've never seen one. Remember back in the day where they were trying to make Jessica Simpson out to be really fucking dumb? And they were like, the tuna, the chicken of the sea, they don't have any wings. What? And they did. It had to be done on purpose for the sake of reality TV garbage. Cheese and crackers. Three meat stuffed crust? Bitch. Oh. What's your three meats? Pepperoni, sausage, and ground beef? Maybe? Don't listen to him. He's drunk on cheese. Sounds like y'all are drunk on cheese. I said it. up to 44. This will take some time. Cheese. Cheese. We're back, you little dark Yu-Gi-Oh. Really dark Yu-Gi-Oh. Wings, Magus, wings. He was talking about me eating wings. Cheese. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. A lot of things happen. I got, I got a lot of things flying around here, you know? I just, it's, hard, it's hard to focus sometimes. Pepperoni, sausage, ham. Ah. Uh, Okay. And cheese. Cheese is understood. If you don't have cheese on a pizza, you get out the fuck out of my house. Um. Why? Why ham? I. At. At no point. Have I thought. That ham. Was a good topping for a pizza when you can have instead of ham. Bacon. Actual bacon, not Canadian bacon. Bacon is Canadian bacon is just ham. Get out of my house. I don't understand ham on a pizza when you could have bacon. I just don't. I'd much prefer even like a bacon. Are you besmirching the honest name of bacon? Really? Fucking slap him. Nothing wrong with bacon. I just feel bacon is superior to ham. And if you have the choice between the two, you go ham. I occasionally put barbecue on pizza instead of pizza sauce. There is a P 
pizza place by me called, I think, Rosati's. So I've had their Hawaiian pizza from a couple places. Yes, it's pineapple on pizza. Flay me alive. The better Hawaiian pizzas put a little bit of barbecue sauce mixed in with the pizza sauce. It's so much better. It's so much better. Not just, not just barbecue sauce and not just marinara sauce but mix the two together so it kind of mellows it out a bit but then it keeps the smokiness of the barbecue sauce perfect it's fucking perfect on pizza no fucking way that's nasty what bacon on a pizza i didn't think to get bacon on it i was in a rush <gasps> hot dog no next time next time i swear it's better felt appropriate <laughs> It's true. Maybe a big sausage. Giba likes her big sausage. She loving that big sausage. Oh lord. Bonk. 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 Fuck. Big pepperoni. Why not bacon on pizza? You know what's wrong? Love Hawaiian pizza. Now. I'd almost prefer on a Hawaiian pizza to have, if I could, grilled chicken instead of ham. But then also bacon. So grilled chicken, bacon, and pineapple. I think that, that makes for a better Hawaiian pizza. I don't understand. Like, why Canadian bacon? Why? why? Now, maybe maybe I'm just picky, but I'd also I, I prefer it if they like chopped up the Canadian bacon a little bit more. Then that way, if it's like, it's basically ham. Have it permeate the rest of the pizza. I like it when you take a bite that you don't get like... Like you're having to chew through the ingredients that it's like, Oh, I get a little bit of everything in every bite. Some people, when they make a Hawaiian pizza, they're just like, they put the circular pineapple slices on it. No, come on. Cut that shit up and spread it out evenly so that way every bite gets all the ingredients. My wiener sword is the best. It is pretty good. It's a good wiener sword. Best wiener sword I've ever seen. Honest. Pineapple on a pizza is an abomination. Okay. I mean, it's not my first choice for a pizza. I still eat it. But I've also committed many, many food sins in my life. You don't even know how much I food sinned. People would weep. Children will cry and run from me. With my food sins. If I get a pizza, it's chicken, peppers, barbecue sauce, and grilled onions. Sometimes pineapple if I if I don't have chicken. What kind of peppers? Are we talking hot peppers? Oh, Banana just, peppers? No, no, it's fine. It's fine. It doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother me. It bothers me. It bothers me a lot. Oh, it's fine. It's fine, and you know it, hot dog. Or is the pineapple? It's the it's the Hawaiian pizza that bothers you. I do pep instead of Canadian bacon most of the time, and add jalapenos sometimes. Ooh, fresh jalapenos. Give that zing to it, that little fire. Warmth. So nice. Or just a regular pepperoni pizza. I got, for simplicity's sake, in terms of simple pizzas, I've long ago, long ago, given up the idea of, like, stacking high toppings on pizza. You get, like, three or four. Four max toppings on a pizza. After that, it just feels cluttered. So your, your classic Supremes feel very cluttered to me. What do you got? You got onion, green uh, green peppers, mushrooms, sausage, pepperoni. That's five ingredients right there. And cheese, yes. The cheese is understood. If we can limit it down to like four, you get a better taste for everything. So this one pizza I ordered, double cheese, double pepperoni, garlic. Holy shit. It was really dense with the cheese. It was, it was so good. But it was also really salty with the amount of pepperoni on it. But it was really good. And it's just simple. It's a pepperoni pizza, but just more. It's snowing? Oh, God. Get out of the great white north. Come to food confession, my son. Oh, man. I, I have dipped um, chicken nuggets in chocolate pudding. Yep. 
Chicken nuggets and chocolate pudding. What else? Chicken nuggets in um, mac and cheese, but that wasn't... That's cheese. It's fine. And then uh, chicken nuggets and applesauce I highly recommend too. So here's the thing about chicken nuggets and applesauce. Cold applesauce, hot chicken nugget. The sweetness of the apples with a little bit of the salty from the chicken nugget, it's like hitting all the things. Oh, baby. It was so good. People judging me. Like red pepper and green pepper? Grilled, always grilled. Grilled is nice. If you get fire roasted, that's even better. But I think grilled is kind of that. It's the closest you can get without fire roasting. It's the pineapple mixing with cheese. It makes me sick to the stomach. So it's not it's not the pineapple mixing with the marinara sauce, because people really hate that. They usually hate that part of it. Uh, I won't eat waffles or pancakes without peanut butter. I'm not eating it. I have to have peanut butter with them both. Like a spread of it? And does it have to be peanut butter, or is there like, are, are you open for almond butter as well? Shit. Who doesn't have shell? Walker. All right, now beat the shit out of him. Put habaneros on my pizza, right? I love peanut butter. I would try that. I, I certainly would. Well, and when it comes to pancakes and waffles, they're basically a dessert anyway, so it fits with all the sweetness. I dunked my PB and J in milk. That doesn't sound odd. That sounds fine. Gibo won't eat tacos without pickles. What? So, wait. That place you went out to get tacos, did they have pickles on the tacos? Like, you went out to eat it. I don't understand other places. Like, you personally making tacos, putting pickles on it, sure. I've never heard of any other establishment putting pickles on tacos. Penis butter. Oh, thank you, Benji. No, peanut butter and syrup on waffle and, or, and pancakes, or I won't eat them. Huh. But does she like hot dogs with her taco? I, I would like hot dogs. But, do I like taco? It's fine. I'm picky with food. I can sense that. Stop gyrating, Yuwaka, you piece of shit. Do that twice more to get Wakas. Because of 40. Jesus. This is painful. Okay. I think I have to remember where, uh, Black, uh, dark Baja was. Dancing hot dogs. Slap. Slap. Shell. So with already leveling everything up, Write your favorite synonym for booba in the chat. Isn't he in the dessert? He who? Melon? Really? Melons? I mean, you are a hot dog. 
So I guess I guess it only fits for you to go to the food route of things. Globes? Golden globes or regular? Are you going top tier? Oh, isn't he in the desert? Ifrit was in the desert. Baja is where you fly Unaleska. And I think that's in the something, the Valley of the Faith? Something like that? Jugs. I like Jugs better than... than uh, and melons. Thing one and thing two. <laughs> See, when you do that, then you have to then you have to talk like uh, uh, Dr. Seuss. It's unfortunate. I don't make the rules. But if you bring up Dr. Seuss, you better start rhyming. Gotta get real creative for the rest of the night. Who does? When was the last time anyone here went to Hooters? Shit. The last time I went to Hooters, it was just like, oh, okay. Is this what... I think maybe in my life, I've been to Hooters maybe less than a handful of times. Maybe three or four times. And every single time, it was only like, okay... Tilted Kilt, though, was really good. Their food was really good. I've never been. Food's only okay. The thing that was goofy about Hooters is they used to swear by their um, their wings, their chicken wings. But I guess you can go to Buffalo Wild Wings with a lot less of the like social stick bun crap. It's fine. Like three years ago, they still a restaurant. Every, every, like, month or so, somebody will get a bug up their butt and talk about how, like, Hooters doesn't need to be a thing anymore, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, well, if people stop going, then sure. I'm not gonna, like, burn down every Hooters I see. I just advocate for going to Tilted Kilt instead. It has better food. Yeah, food was meh. There was nothing that really, like, wowed me. Like, oh, we gotta go. They have the best burgers, wings, whatever. Their wings were only okay. I went to Hooters once or twice, like, 20 years ago. That's what I feel most people are like. I don't know a single person who, like, consistently goes to Hooters and thinks it's, like, an amazing establishment. It was just like, oh, I went, yeah, a couple times. You, you see, um... Like, jokes online will be people being like, Oh, man, he likes Hooters. Oh, ho, ho, he always wants to go to Hooters. Ho, ho, ho. It's like, no, realistically, why would you go there when there are better options for food? Coconuts. Beach balls. Yeah, I remember we had really horrible service. Oh, that's awful, too. If the service... Hey, I I would say this of any establishment. If your food is only so-so, but your service is stellar, I think that would make me recommend a place. Because then at least it would be like, okay, go in with low expectations on the food, but you'll get taken care of. Not how I meant. Not how I meant. Um... I don't know. I don't know if good service outweighs poor food. Because there are those, like, Karen restaurants. You go in and they intentionally insult you. But the food is pretty good. So if the food isn't good, but the service is really good, then it's like, well, why are you going? I can just, I can order out and just take home the food. I don't need the service. Where am I? Fun bags. The funnest of bags. I went once when I was 18. Ah. Your luck just got better because Titus is here. Hello, Titus from Spira. We're right now trying to get some more more luck on our side. But, you know, you're here, so that adds a little bit of luck. We are up to about 44 for our main three that we're working on. But I'm uh, just kind of like wandering around the grid and filling up any of the existing fortune spheres that I have before I really start having to dig for uh, filling out the blank spheres. Yikes. 
I guess I should probably do that. Where's, where's another place I can go to that has a lot of blank spheres that I can just, like, sit and burn up, like, four or five? That looks like a spot. Here we go. So, like, right here. He okay, so here. So all these down here. I could probably sit in one area and then buy a bunch of spheres. Especially here. There's one, two, three, four. Right here. So we'll go down to here and see if I can do the one, two, three, four, five. Ease of use. So go here. The girls tickle biddies. Tickle biggities. Bit biggities. Biggity biggity biggity. Two fifty five on everything. You don't need luck. You are maxed out. That's what I hear. For my personal preference, I kind of want to get at least to a hundred luck. Mostly, I'm trying to see if the grind is as bad as they're saying it is. It's not great. It may not be the worst grind, but it's not great. And I, the issue is, is there's no, there's no achievement for getting maxed out stats. There's an achievement for filling the grid, and holy shit, that would be a lot of spheres that I have to fill out. So, but I still want to get Riku. Her triple overdrive, no, triple AP, overdrive to AP, triple overdrive, so that way I can max out her character as well, because there is a monster in the monster arena that's underwater, and so it'll be Waka, Titus, and Riku that fight him. Is she missing teeth? Looks like she's got a gap here. Oh, good God, she is a child. Uh, I think 100 luck is adequate. That's what I've heard. What does luck do in this game? Uh, according to the holy internets, uh, I just had it. Where was it? Luck. Luck increases each party's member luck stats subsequently increases their chance of scoring a critical hit with their attacks and spells. Critical hits increase the amount of damage done by the attack. Uh, the effects of luck stack... Of d oh, that's fine. That's a different thing. So it's kind of like it plays a little extra with with some of the stuff. Some people were saying that you add it into your existing stats. So basically, it helps you hit, and it helps you not get hit when somebody tries to hit you. That's what I'm. That's what I've been told. That's what I hear. It's gonna fill the grid just like she wants it. Who is Titus? Titus. Titus. This is Titus. Titus from Spira. This is Titus from Spira. From, from the game. It's a joke! But I think a lot of the guides online are... They say how much of a slog it is because they're not cranked up four times speed like mine is. Okay. Can you summon faster? Weirdo. No, not item. White magic. Alright, let's slap him. Good old orky orcs. Oh, I didn't cast, uh... Get, Jesus. Okay. You got it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh, that's right. This guy has less defense. You bitch. Fucking auto life for the save. Oh, you bitch! Cut that shit out right now, I swear to god. They make this a challenging fight, so it's kind of a pain in the ass when we do this. Okay, white man. 
magic. No, Kiraga. Oh. There we go. Alright, now we're back up to where we should be. Slap. Every single time it's Ultima. That's so awful. If I didn't have the speed up, this would be just complete pain. And all of this for two spheres. It doesn't even die fast. Go away. Go away faster. Boop ba doo. Like it's no wonder that they gave these these monsters the higher luck bad brain. I'm having a stroke. Quick, somebody give me more cheese. That'll help my stroke. Lots attack reels. <laughs> Got it. Why, thank you, Cat Board. Hello, Cat Board. Here we go. So, cheese, cheese, cheese. Butter, spread it on the bread. Bollocks. Cheese. 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 Ground bread. Love that song. Love it. Slap a dark Bahamut. After I get these this these five. Gimme give gimme give this this little corner here. When I get this corner done for Titus, Yuna, and Waka, we're gonna go slap Baja. So that's one more fight with the spear and a couple more fights with the, the other goober. I think the worst part of this is like you have to wait for it to be like summoned and then it, to go away. Not like it pops up and then I can just slap it in the dick. I'm wondering how bad it's going to be the fight with, with uh, Baja. If I cast auto life on everyone, it kind of makes this a little easier. The Spheres animations? Yeah, it's fucking it's forever. Forever in a day. Look at those hits. Fucking 80, 90k. He done did a hydraulic press on my ass. Oh, crap. Yuna died. But all of my speed is so, so high up that everyone just fucking slaps him. Tis a cat board. Tizzy Bort of Cat, he is a PhD, he is gone to school. Oh my god, stop. Holy fucking shit. Please 
die. Don't make me call out Anima. Why are you not dying, you piece of shit? There we go. Yeah, that, that command's getting a lot of work tonight. Oh, God, and it gives me dark matter. God damn it. The time that I don't want dark matter is when they give me dark matter, and I want dark matter. Right, screw this. After this, if once I get two more spheres from this stupid sphere, I'll, I'm gonna find Baja. Is Dark Bahamut in the Dark Faith? The Faith? 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 Something? Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm sorry. Ooh. Ooh, I wasn't ready for that. That one kind of hurt. I think it was because I twisted my body. I don't like it. It's not getting as much work as you're getting. Buy that jelly. Right. The Greater Booba. That was a cute sneeze, like a kitten. What kind of fucking kittens you know. Dark behind Xanarkins. That is. That is. Tough ones? I know kittens from the streets. Auto Connors can eat a dick. Hero, tis the Fooby. The Fooberino. The Foombastic. Mr. Foombastic. Shagnastic? What was it? Who was it? It am a Fooby. Fooby am a Foobying. All the Foob that's fit to doob. Oh my god, die. taking so long. Why is this taking so long? Ah, thank god. At least I give a crap ton of XP for this. My eye is twitching and I can't stop it. Shut up. Grinding out these basics. Alright, so we got those. But I have no fortune spheres. I have no maidens. Um, yeah, just me grinding out that. I have how much? Dark matter? 78. We are almost ready to get some ribbon. Alright, Xanarkin. Oh my god. Airship. Let's go slap a Baja. Okay. You're counting. Xanarkin. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Turn off encounters. I don't need that shit. Ooh, this music, though. I do really like this song. What's annoying is, oh, well, hang on, take the take the lift here. Go up and confirm. Um, you play this game. This game is good. It's very good. The problem is, is you. What the fuck? Want to go? All right, go up the thing. Um, 
the problem is is that it's very repetitive with the music. Baja is my least favorite Dark Ian fight. Why is that? Is that Green Leader? Gre what the fuck are you doing? No, I'm not playing your game. I already played that game. We're getting the fuck out of here. Uh, the problem is these stupid teleport pads. These? Oh god, still go away. Fuck off! Don't want any of your shit. You'll see why he sucks. Oh. I think I read a vague, uh, review. Online. My main concern is status effects. I don't have ribbons on yet. But if I have to grind that out, I don't think that's too terrible. I'll just keep grinding uh, luck and then I'll end up getting it. That music, though. Alright, let's 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 turn down the... Look at him! I love the skin for him. It's so good. Alright. So first and foremost, we cast auto life on fucking everyone. Because we're gonna die. It gonna happen. Music though. Okay, let's go. Breathing is Steve the bad. Good Steve or bad Steve? I don't know. I'm doing the best I can. Santa's coming less than ten months. All right. Let's see what happens if we just give him a slap. Do I have to raise my accuracy? Because holy shit, that shouldn't have missed. Alright, yep. Slappy bitch. Alright. Slots. Attack reels. Fuck. I knew I fucked up on that one. Damn it. I feel like I'm in a slot machine. <laughs> With all the, the stuff. Yeah. Sword play. Go slice some dice. Damn it. And he's got like 4 million health. You shitting me, boy? Let's do... Can I do a double cast? Let's see what the double cast does. It's a special. Special double cast? Yeah, double cast. Let's go Ultima twice. See what happens. So maybe magic does more than physical attacks? No. The answer is no to that. That's awful. So what I'm seeing is quick hits. Let's just keep physically attacking. This won't be good. I see. I see. So I wondered who who did the petrify because everyone's like, "Come on, the petrify, you got to have you got to have stone proof. Got to have stone proof." I'm like, "Who who does that?" Baja. Baja does that. And we winning. Nope. Back to the airship. I was going to say you're going to have a bad time without ribbon or stone proof. I'm almost ready to just make my own ribbon. 
We're counting. Yeah! Here we go! Ugh. Pick that up. Turn that off. There we go. Zoom. At least everyone moves at a fast enough pace that it's not... You don't need a... Uh... Who am I missing? The sage, that's done. Killika, done. Meehan Road, done. Mushroom Rock Road, done. J Jose, done. Thunder Plains, not done. Makalania, done. Bicknell, Sue and Sandworm, oh crap. Calmlands, the Ogre, Malboro, Stolen Faith, Yowie, Tonberry, Gagazette, Dark Flame, Grendel. That's not done. Insight Sin is not done. Mega Dungeon, Black Element. Oh, fuck off. Gotta get 10 of every single thing. Oh, uh, these are... These are legends. Gotta get 10 of every single thing in order to... Unlock. To get 99. Darkness. Oh, fuck. I don't like it. How many Dark Manders do you have now? 79? Almost 80? Pretty up there. It's, it's about, like, I'm within spitting distance of being able to just craft my own ribbon with all the crap that I've been doing. With all of this, all this grinding has led up to that. Good Christ. I'd grind out the rest of the 99 to do capture the 99 more. That was the plan. Yep. That was the plan. Because if I get the 90, like, there's no reason, to, if I get the 99 now, that blows out 70-something ones that I've earned myself through hard work. All the hard work. So I guess that's where I'm stuck now, is, uh, either, either putting stone proof on all of it, which, that seems like a waste, when I have a ribbon that I could be putting on things. I just don't want to have to recreate more gear. Flap. And it seems like, for the most part, everyone's physical attacks do more damage than anything else. Because I've yet to use Ultima on a thing and have it be like, oh my god, that's 99k. usually way less. And everyone's immune to everything under the sun. Hey look, Dark Matter. Whenever I'm looking for for luck spheres, I get Dark Matter. So where are we at now? 80. I have 80 Dark Matter right now. Easy. Easy every time. You know what? Fuck it. I get enough mag like stuff from this. We'll just do auto heals. Walk a 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 walk a
It's like, ah, my testes. So why is that thing taking a nap? Because he sucks. That's just the coding for the monster. You give him enough damage, he flips on his back, and then he just casts magic. And balls to its ass. Yes. luck you have the more the more you can do that slap and then he poots out the flame My luck grind, I set the command window to memory and put the attack button on turbo. 10 out of 10 would cheat again. Man, if you could imagine that one mod that gives everyone the XP, I wouldn't need the, that stupid AP grind thing. You get that for one character, everyone would have 99 moves all the time. All the time. No, let me heal first. I mean, that's the kind of thing, it's like, is it is it a good game mechanic? Is the game doing a good job of being a game? Where you have people who are, I mean, there's always going to be people who are going to try to bypass things and cheat. Or make it easy. But, for holy crap's sake, there might be a reason everyone wants to do that. When your game isn't fun to play, to get what they want. Jesus Christ. That man had a family. Oh, wait, actually, somebody was telling me what Yojimbo? Yojimbo, you can farm for dark materia? Or dark, dark. What is it? Dark matter? Whatever. Dark materia. I don't. Eh. Maybe I'll do that. I mean, this way I am grinding out more luck, but if we're going specifically for give me ribbon fuel... Lucky, lucky ribbon fuel. Let's see. So it's 64. Oops. Now, if I can get Waka's luck up as well, that means when he throws out all of his balls, it has a chance of hitting a, a crit on that. Uh, since I beat the game so many times, I don't, I didn't feel bad using the AP mod. Triple AP didn't apply to your characters out of the party, though. Ah, okay. You can potentially get Ribbon Armor from Yojimbo, I think. Interesting. Dark Yojimbo can drop Ribbon Armor. You just have to fight him a lot and get lucky. We're up all night to get lucky.
slept. He farted. He farted in my face. Such an interesting looking enemy, too. He's kind of like a dinosaur. Kind of. Right in the dick. And where is Dark Yojimbo? Is he in the same cave that you get regular Yojimbo? There's Dark Matter. To 82 now. Yes. Oh, is he? Okay. Oh my god. Crit, crit, crit. And that's what they're saying. They're saying you need those crits in order to deal, like, double damage. Because a lot of these things have such strong defense that you're not hitting for 99k at all. Not even close. At least they're not missing. Like Baja, they were missing. See if by doing this I could be leveling up Riku at the same time. At least a little bit. Fuck. Bonk. Bonk. And she can leave for Waka. Bonk. How many times do you have to fight you, Jimbo? Five or something? Five in a row without losing, leaving a reloading. Which, if you do that, it'll start it over, but then that means that you can farm him. And keep purposely resetting the count. Right. They only give Riku two. Oh, no. With infinite ribbon armor grind, I'm sure it's faster than grinding out a third set of 99 dark matter. Yeah, certainly. So what is what does the ribbon armor give you? Gives you ribbon and then four slots or three slots, three empty slots? Three empty slots. 
Wait, one, two. It's two. And he's down. He's really casting it out of his ass. Ah, stop yawning. He doesn't always drop four slot ribbon armor. I've gotten three slot before. It's random. Yay. Love random. I need more dark matter. Feetman's Dan Dandefeet? Oh shit. Okay. Andy farts. Andy farts. He also drops gear that doesn't have ribbon on it too. I think he's got break damage limit weapons and a break HP limit gear too. Well, I have a lot to look forward to. It seems. Grind for everything being 255 is just awful. Alright. See if we can harvest more dark matter, I guess. God, that, that luck grind is is pretty awful. I don't know if it's as bad as they say it is, but it certainly ain't good. Sip here just in case.
Come on. Go the right way. I went the wrong way. that drip. You are a fading dream, but one touched by reality. Spiro will not forget its reality. 4K speed helps. It seems to, yeah. Saved it. Run, dream, run on. Pass beyond the waking. And walk into the daylight. At least these fights are free. So that's the thing. Obtain strength sphere. What? Is it ribbon time? Kind of. Oh yeah, I think all the faiths give you stat up spheres if you revisit them. I, I mean, thank you. Um, I don't, I don't need that. Can I give you, can I get luck though? Can I go back? Where am I? I'm gonna redo some cloisters. No. No. Where am I supposed to go to get Yojimbo? Try walking out? Okay. Oh, okay. There we go. This fucking fool. <laughs> How can he see? <clears throat> That's a weird hat. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. Yo. Alright, we fight! Ambush, fuck you! Now I'm seeing why some people are like, hey, maybe get the HP up. Because <laughs> if your team wipes like that, is ambush common? Ooh boy. At least I saved. There. Sometimes that happens you can't do anything except have someone with first strike. Okay. Can I skip this? Fuck. Really? Oh god, no. You are a fading dream, but one touched by reality. Spiro will not forget its reality. Perfect timing coming in. the one who saved it. <laughs> Welcome, Iverson. Run, dream, run on. Yeah, just got, got ganked. Pass beyond no way to skip it, it doesn't seem like. I got the full party ambush. Oh, I can... Okay, I can skip some of his... Okay. Yes, I can. Uh, full party ambush one time, I think. I don't know how common it is. And yeah, you get ambushed every time for your first fight against him. I feel so honored. Strength sphere. Yeah, I don't need it. Everyone's already max strength. Or at least the main characters that I'm using for these fights. Let me get to the grindy bit, Mr. Man. Gang signs. Strength sphere, strength sphere. Yeah, okay. What about Kimari? Shh, shh. 
Shh. Shh. He doesn't have the grapes. Ambushed. Back to the calm lands to grind out more dark matter so I can get a ribbon? That won't stop me from dying to Yojimbo. Do I have to craft specially made items so I get first strike so he doesn't wipe me immediately? You telling me that these optional bosses weren't in the original? I am shocked. What happens if I just leave right here? Oh, that's all I need. I don't need to talk to that guy anymore. Give me a strength sphere or not, I don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck. Kimari would die just like everyone else. He wouldn't even get a chance to self-destruct. He does look really fucking cool though. Do your Jimbo against your Jimbo. Have Auron in with his weapon and switch to Yuna and summon to eat his first attack. Oh, that's right. Yeah, the summon will eat it. Then have fun trying to him. Trying to him him with your regular hit him with your regular attacks after. Yay. Can I leave? I don't think I can walk around him. Nope. Hit him. Yeah. Doing that shit. Alright. So just give somebody a weapon that has first strike? Is what I'm hearing? Break HP limit, auto life, auto haste, ribbon. I have auto life, auto haste. Ribbon's coming soon, but the break HP limit is the thing I've been like dragging ass on doing. Um. Because I don't want to keep... I just want to... I don't want to make any more armor. Eh. Leave me alone. So here's what I have. So he's got Phoenix Shield. Auto Phoenix, Auto Haste, Auto Protect. Auto Protect, I guess, is the thing that you don't necessarily need all the time. If you have more HP, then you don't need the, the Auto Protect for health. Because your, your HP will tank the rounds enough that you can cast Protect and that's fine. So what cost, what do you have for, what do you need, excuse me, for HP limit? I don't think I have anything for it. I don't think I have the thing, it doesn't even show up on the thing. Oh, there it is, break HP limit, there it is. Wings to discovery. And what, pray tell, type of newfangled fuckery do I need to get wings of discovery? What happened? I died. Yojimbo keeps killing me. Chocobo feathers? Shit, how do you how do you farm those? Farming guide, farming guide, farming guide. Bribes, it ain't cheap. Malboro. You get four wings from regular Malboros for 550,000 gil. You get eight wings from a great Malboro for 1.28 million gil. The easiest place to find Malboros is in the northwestern area of the Calm Lands. The easiest place to find great Malboros is in the Omega Ruins, although they spawn inside the final dungeon too. Uses. How many does it take to do that? They say it's a personal judgment call whether it's worth the slot, but how the fuck do you tank Yojimbo's first attack? Let 
me see. F X Dark Yo Jim Boat. Ow. Just mod the items in. Just mod Tifa in and she'll she'll kick him and win. You have 255 vitality. Auto protect might not be doing much. Yeah, I have 255 everything else, yeah. Uh I think bribing the big worm. It's bribing Melboro, apparently. More chocolate races. Shut up, Fiber. Please. Uh, do the Auron thing, I said. Okay. Just Auron? He needs the right weapon, though. We're backing up here. So, formation. We'll do Auron instead of who? Auron for who? Auron for Yuna. And then swap out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Do, 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 do. Items. No, equip. Auron. Oh, he has first strike on his on his uh, celestial weapon. Easy every time. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Crank that up. Crank that off. Uh, an easy thirty wings can also be earned by completing the Remium Chocobo race with all three stress collections. Shh, sh shut the fuck up. Not doing it. Not doing it. Chocobo races. As always, it comes back to the Chocobo races. Boo, I say. Booba, do I say. Your bullshittery. I've had enough of your bullshittery. God damn, he's so cool. So, who should I summon? I think he did that already before fighting Unaleska. I didn't do all of it. I did what I needed to get the triple 9999. But I didn't get all of the prizes. Because I went, that's bullshit. He is so upset that I just, like, juked in. Okay, so we summon in Yuna. Who do we summon? The triple four nines, or whatever the fuck, yeah. Who are we summoning? We could do Anima. And then just... Kabosh him. Doesn't really matter, they're all dead after one move. Well, Anima it is. Oblivion. Yeah, just eat the attack. That's why I think Yuna is so much better than Lulu. In terms of magic dealing, Yuna's got a lot going for her. The, the summon is so good. He didn't die. Bazooka. There you go. That's so much fucking damage. Holy shit. Mommy, it's dead now? Shut up, Viper. You don't even know what's going on in the story. <laughs> Alright, now that we're here... Auto life on everyone. That was an actual... That was a very good strategy, Catboard. Thank you for the recommendation. Because now at least I'm doing something. Is that legit, like, textbook strategy on that? Get out of my way, dog! Get out of my way, dog! Uh. She, grand, she does have Grand Summon. So, that summon that I did, that was Anima's ultimate. So I still have... Yo, Jimbo! So I still have... I can cast... What do you mean, now's the fun part? I can cast the Maggot Sisters and have them do their ultimate, too. How much HP does this guy have? He's like one million and change or something. I don't know if it's textbook. I think I just managed to have Auron in the party by coincidence. Lucky. 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 
upon entering Dark Yojimbo encountering, uh, random encounters will be disabled. They will return once of the following encounters. Wins the fifth encounter, uses the teleporter near the entrance, resets the count, it's fine. Always an uh, ambushes the party in the first battle, even with initiative. Player can still act for with first strike weapons. Okay, there we go. The battle is easier if all characters have maxed out strength, defense, and agility, as well as having luck at 125 or higher. Luck can be lower if the player uses aim five times, or ultra null all, which includes the effect. To improve their accuracy, stoneproof ribbon, auto haste, auto protect, auto phoenix are also useful if not necessary. A high defense stack can mitigate damage. Eh. Eh. Uh, it's also possible to defeat Yojimbo by using an Aeon. The Mega Sisters and Anima are recommended. The player can simply power through the battle using quick hit every turn while hasted and call an Aeon when Yojimbo's turn comes up. Dark Yojimbo has relatively low magic defense. Double casting Ultima deals decent damage. If the party members have copycat, they can easily repeat it. Can be killed by you. you yeah, yeah. Dark Yojimbo can be killed by other Yojimbo. Break HP limit allows the character to go beyond the normal HP cap, extending all the way to 99k. Yes! Yes. 1.6 mil. Okay, basically you need maxed out accuracy and very high luck in order to hit assholes like Dark Yojimbo and, or Dark Mindy. I was hurt. I was being told somewhere online and other places I don't need more more luck. Yeah, I'm 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 summoning the Maga sisters. Do it. We need the sexy bug lady. Hello, oh no, child. Combine. Maybe get Fubi Jimbo? James. Jamathan. Steve, the one on the end. Shut up, you're fat. He's gonna fucking just wipe me in one hit like he usually does. Let's see. If I attack reels. You don't need 255 luck, but it needs to be decently high. Mine was between 90 and 100, I think. That's what I was. Here I am going like I'd like it to get 100. You guys are like. Baha, Baha, Baha. Luck increases your chance of crit attacks and dodging attacks. Fuck! I hate it. I hate it so much. God damn it. Four attacks. Eat a dick, nuts. Alright, um. Summon. I'll just summon Balafor. Just every time it's his turn, summon. I think it'll be fine as long as you summon before turn. Yep, that's what it seems to be. Now, what can I do with this goober that'll do any sort of anything? Sure, attack. Hey, he actually hit. Slap him around. Oh, I missed. Okay, now we quick hit the fuck out of him. Well, no, I need to aim a couple more times. I think I'm on three aims. The fact that it doesn't keep that... Four... Five. The fact that it doesn't keep that known as a pain in the ass. 
Yeah, that was three times. Now four. Shut up. Who told you you could count? Now five. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, he's winded. Oh, he's a winded boy. Alright, do a summon here. My money. <laughs> Quick hit is great. It's great when I remember it. And I don't. Miss. Oh my god, I should have magic attacked him. Ifri, you piece of shit! Go home, you drunk! Your team got too up fast. He's weak. I've had that happen to me. Skill. It's skill. Go under skill. Quick hit is under skill. I keep trying to put it under special and it doesn't work. Skill. 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 Summit. Ixion. I see stars when I stand up. It's fine. I'm fine. And then you hit the floor. Sure, why not? At least that magic attack actually hit. Can't afford to see Steve when standing up. Stand up so fast you see me, you need to go to a fucking doctor. That's crazy, you're not missing. Shh. Deuces with the overkill. Yeah, he sees stove. All right, now all of that—that that was a long, that was a longer fight than any of the other ones. So, what are you gonna give me? Dark matter. Just, just two dark matter and rematch. Okay. You better run, bitch. See you in hell, bitch. So every single encounter now, I have to have, I have to have, um, I have to have Oron in for Yuna, so he doesn't fucking wipe me? Really? So how do I reset it? Do I just leave the, I can use the, um, Ghibli Jubli, this, this thing right here, the teleporter, leave, come back in, and then we do all this again? Is that how that works? Not always an ambush. Well, I just saved, so we can find out. Alright. I got ads as soon as you beat him. Oh. Sorry. Uh, you can go to the airship from the safe sphere. Okay. Can't I just this exit out? That would probably be faster, wouldn't it? My tingling! Jugs and orbs and darts and gourds. Elmer fuds and bouncing ludas. Sweater stretchers, lung protectors. You have to beat him like five times, hot dog. But you can grind or you can farm dark matter from him so that way you can craft ribbon. You have to beat him five times, but if you leave the counter, resets. Yeah. That's why it's used as a farming mechanism for dark ribbon. Humpty dumplings, oh, party boys, double lattes, ode to joys, hooters, shooters, it's a halo shirt. Bobsy twins and ball commuters. They're on a double, double UMDs, MREs and PFDs, Snow White dwarfs, Picasso's. So I guess we'll do that. We'll exit out. Words for boobs. Show us Bob Stowe. <laughs> there, there they are. Look right there. Not mine there. Servers, holy grails, whoopee cushions, humpback whales, flying saucers, traffic stoppers, super big gulps, double whoppers, pillows, billows, Don DeLillos, soft serve cones and armadillos, soft serve cones, so good. 99 words for boots. Remind your horny classmates what your words are. There's 
we go all the way over here and then we leave again. And it's the same first encounter. Gotcha. Midget earmuffs, warming globes, strobes and probes and frontal lobes. Knockers, honkers, knicker bonkers, smurfs and screaming yellow zonkers. Penny cannons, Mr. Biggs, big bad wolves and porky pigs. Jogging partners, words for boobs. I believe in you! I'm hearing he ambushes every time. I think I think I read that online that he ambushes every time. Yeah, he does. Every time. Catbort. Back to school with you. Your PhD is worthless. I saved. Turn that. Oh, damn it. Turn that up. Turn that off. I have a PhD in cat proctology. <laughs> cat board is best board. This also feels like a long, like, feel like grinding out my luck might be better. Because that has a chance of dropping. Uh, hello, Iron Hand! That has a tra chance of dropping uh, dark matter. Uh oh. Do Capor think of probiotic business? Yep! Five times. One. Two. Three. Four. Shit. One more. But I have to summon somebody so we don't die. Yogurt? What? What about? Oh, big bacteria is a scam. All dairy is a scam? You fucking what, mate? Fooby like cheese. Everyone like cheese. We like it the cheese! Okay, just in case I fuck up, I'll put auto life on everyone as well. This fight is so much more in-depth than just grinding out luck spheres. Flap. Cricket. Flap. Summon. Ixion. The horse fucker. Flap. He's so damn cool. You know? Keep trying to go to special. It's skill. Quick hit is a skill. What do you get when you steal? Nope. Skill. Are 
recently found out that my cat likes cheese, so she gets small bits of mozzarella with dinner. Nice! Elixir? Oh, okay. Not, not amazing, but okay. She'll have to summon here. Shiva! Ice Booba Lady. Your dog attacked me. I'm suing. I do think that's kind of interesting that the, the summons are relatively similar throughout all of um, Final Fantasy. So if there's a Final Fantasy connected universe, the summons are like the, the key connectors to all of it. So... So... That might mean that the, uh, the summons are the key characters. There's Shiva in every single one. Bahamut in some flavor is in every single one. See, this is where you would want to change the, uh, the overdrive to dealing damage instead of taking damage. Big Daddy B. At least I have plenty of summons. After you meet Nojimba this time, heal at the save sphere and follow him for the second fight. I want to see if that one is an ambush too. Okay. Except for Final Fantasy XII. XII was a disaster. Did they have, in terms of story, did they have summons in that one? Bop. Your dog attacked me. Prepared to die. Jesus Christ. Wait, is my ult up? Nope. Whoa! Oh, here's Zanmato. Oh, 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 oh. There should be like the the infinite symbol should come up. Like you you dealt all the damage that's possible of being dealt in this game. Boom! Dead. Still so damn cool. What story? A lot of people shit on 12. I don't remember 12 getting this much hate when it first came out. They have summons, but they're all new Aeons. Not at all what I fucking wanted. Master Sphere. What does the Master Sphere do? Activates any ability or attribute node. They're all done. Master Spheres are great. No, they're not. I'm already done. Where's my save? There's my save. Okay, we're saving. And then we're going to go uh, adventure a little bit more and see if we, we die immediately. Okay. Second encounter. Basically a free fortune sphere. I'll have to try it. Okay! Every single first encounter for the very first Ojimbo, yes. Ambushed. Second one, no. Well, for shit's sake, since I'm already here, may as well do the thing. One. Two. Three. Four. She can go again. Ladies. Five. Okay, now. Cricket. Bop. Oops. Cricket. Bop. Summon. Balafor. It can activate luck nodes. Okay, this is what I remembered then. I was like, there's no way I forgot that he ambushes five times in a row. Yeah, you... Something like that would immediately make somebody go... Yeah, that's an awful fight. Are you 
killed my booba bird. Am I brain damaged? That's what I ask myself every morning. No. Yeah, it is skill. Damn it. Clap. Clap. Remember I said I needed to change the overdrive? I didn't. Meteor Strike. Rocket Launcher. Heavy Machine Gun. Just imagine that, like, future iterations of Final Fantasy is I cast gun. You just shoot him with a cannon. My nose itches. This seems like a fairly easy and common strategy that I might be able to use on Bahamut. Every time it's Bahamut's turn, you throw out a summon. Just that easy. Just let him hit you one time as a treat. Uh, no. Give me your money. Give me your fucking wallet, Jimmy. The dog's still there. Oh, no. Whoops. Give me a Genji sphere. Or a Genji. Genji. Genji goggles? No. Okay. Items. Go to equipment. Go. There we go. No. Stop. How do I. Break HP limit. Curse proof. What is it? Defending Bracer? That, that didn't go much higher than 9,999. That's a little annoying. here. Come on, you. Oh my god, save. So I got two Master Spheres out of that. Uh, so I just saved. Where am I? Okay, so move to here. Let's see what one of these Master Spheres do. Since I'm getting so many of them. Activates any ability or attribute node. Okay. Yeah. Oh! I see. I see. Can I move it around? Oh my god, where am I at? Where am I? So yeah, on the board, at all, at all, on the board. I see. I see. Crap, where is that one again? Okay, well I'll do that one for each one of them. So eat that one's done. Okay, now I understand what it means. So what's their what's their luck up to now? 66. Jesus Christ. It ain't in the hundreds, I tell you that much right now. Alright.
So at least we know how that one works. Um... Shit. So maybe we can do that same type of attack on Bahamut. Let me see. Let me change the overdrive then. Set mode to what? Character takes damage. Character damages enemy. When character defeats an enemy, allies take damage. No. When character defeats a powerful enemy, charges of a party wins battle. Charges on character character's turn? I am changing my overdrive command. I'm doing it right now. Charges when character damages enemy. So I guess that's the one we want. Try that. Because we don't have enough health to be taken the damage. And we'll be instantly wiped anyway. Self-destruct with Kamari. No. Okay, so we got all that done. Good, yes. Okay. Well, save while we're here. And we'll give, uh... We're count. Problem is I don't have all my overdrives ready, but we'll see. Go back to Xanar again. Here we go! We'll encounter Baja one more time. The only strategy to beat Dark Bahamut is the self-destructive Kamari. You say that, but also, I think you're full of crap. So... There you go. Maybe that's the next thing I'll do. I'll try to get Kamari maxed out health-wise. I'll get an HP break on him, and it'll be lovely. We'll just have him run in and just... Boom. Boom. Go that. I hate this. That way, yes. Yes. No, this one is oh, you can't go forward. Which one of us has actually beaten Dark Baham? What? I don't know, I haven't seen you beat it. Self destructive Kamar. Okay, come on. vote on it. Oh god. <laughs> Everyone would vote yes. Uh, okay, so we'll do that. Okay, here we go. Zoop. Alright, so same strat- we're gonna try the same strategy that we used for Jimbo against Bahamut. It's just going to take way longer, because he has all the fucking health. So, first and foremost, we do auto life. In case he wipes us. No white magic. What? One self destruct, two not to do it. One, 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 one. Just do it before Dark Bahamut murders you again. I swear, if he. What'd that even do? He's gone! That's right, I can't swap out his character though. Oh bitches. That that's the part I hate. He gets self-destruct and that's and then just leaves it as a spot. Now I have to just I now I just have two characters. I did it for you. Like, comment, subscribe. Leave me alone. Oh, I still need to I need to raise their goddamn aim. This can't hit. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Okay. Yeah, they can't hit for shit. Bahama kicks like a fucking truck, though. This is awful. Okay, there we go. Done. 
Oh, that was a retaliation, though. Oh, shit. Those were just attacks. It wasn't even his turn yet. Okay, so I can't use that strategy. Because that's a... That's a uh... Oh, fuck. What's it called? A counter? Yeah, it's a counter. Ribbon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made Kimari explode. Everyone fuck off now. Alright, so I can't use the same strategy against Yojimbo that I did against uh, him. So, back to the airship. You can't use the Aeon attack because he uses impulse for every five hits. I see that. We're count. Here we go! That's the real info? I trust you, Catbort. For now. But also, if you self-destruct Kamari, it's funnier. The problem is I had the uh, speed turned up way too high, so we couldn't really savor it. We should have slowed it down so we could see it in slow-mo of him going... Why am I here? Oh, right. The murders. Now we can just farm this guy for better gear so then I can level up Riku and everyone else. Sorcery ring. Oh, fuck, that's right. They don't drop very well. Okay. Okay. So I think as it stands now, how many unused spheres do I have? Where is it? One, two, three. So I only have those three on the board are freebies that I don't need a Lux Sphere for. Okay. <laughs> Why is Green Leader fighting Macaulay Culkin with a hot dog sword? Why not? That is the good and proper counter to that, yes. Is the sphere fully unlocked? The the what sphere? The sphere grid? I don't yeah, I used up all of the uh there are no level four locks. We are good to go to just go ham on the blank the blank nodes that are available here. Of which there are a few. So kind of my plan was to grind out some more Lux Spheres, and then every time I get Dark um, dark Matter, uh, which I have 84, I almost have 99, I'll be able to put Ribbon on somebody. You look cold. How many level 3 Key Spheres do you have left over? Oh, quite a few. 54. Should we start replacing lower nodes with higher nodes? Oh, fuck. I guess, yeah, that's the thing you can do, but no, I'm not going to. So, there. It's just there's... Oh, you want the Batman hat. Oh, picky, 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 picky. Yeah, but I guess that's the thing you can do now, since a lot of these nodes are only, like, they only give you... Like, some strength nodes only give you one strength instead of four, which is the max. So, you remove one and get that one, and then you'll be maxed, and then you can remove multiple of the small ones and keep doing... No, I'm not doing that. The grid can burn in hell at that point. Now the grid is no longer fun. You can use clear spheres to turn useless nodes into luck nodes. That's what I did when I stopped wanting to move anyone on the grid. I'd rather just beat up Don Tonberry and move out the grid. But that is fun. It's fun for somebody other than me. Oof. How much money do I have? Can you 
making sure stacks do look OP. They're 255 for everything except, uh, Space Force. What? 255 for everything except luck. Correct. Triple overdrive. What I need is that AP so I can level up the other characters. But it's hard as hell to get those to drop. Alright, Spear Grid. Here we go. There's Titus. There's Yuna. There's Waka. So they're all pretty much maxed out and their luck is at 65-66. Yes, I have 255 magic. Did all that yesterday. Useless stat. Honestly, I'm finding that out, yeah. Every time I've used Ultima on somebody, it's been like 9,000 damage. Nothing brings 99k damage other than bonking them. Did you do that yesterday? Yep. You just said it. I did. Your typing is faster than the words that are coming into you from the internet. But I still want to level up Riku. Uh, or on... Like, I, I'd like to... If I can get the AP one for all the characters, just run them through the grid. That's fun for me, at least. Now that I've put spheres, like, all over the fucking place. <gasps> Booba. Riku for certain, yeah, because there's that one water enemy. So that's kind of what I've been doing with the fight of the monsters. The water fights, right? Thank you. So we bop him once, and then we switch out with Riku. Riku Suave. Bop him. Bop him. Now they say, who said, somebody said, you raise the, the chances. Nerf this. You raise the chances of getting something to drop for that specific character if they get the killing blow. I'm gonna get a lot of magic defense spheres, is what's looking like. It's what it's looking like. Yeah, I turned the volume down on that because it hurts. And people were playing it a lot. Who or Daka should be overdrive. Viper, if you want to sit at home and just listen to it loudly until you go deaf, that's on you. It was too loud. Thank you, Tune to Key. I said it claimed it too much. Get those he did it. He broke it. The Randall. If it's too loud, you're too old. If you can't spell the difference between you and your, you're too dumb. You did correct it. Hark is booba. <laughs> booba. <laughs> it's not. It's not that it's like I can't enjoy it because it's too loud. This this music is no. It's it's just ear cancer. I got ambushed. The fuck. Well, I guess we're dead. I just killed Rick Riku. Oh, wait, we're not dead. You are, though. Die. Look down and suck my correction. I did see it. I did see it. I was still made the comment, though, because I can. Roasted. Where are the Nazi? Nazi. Your urant. Humstvuk. Black Hat wins again. You cheated, though. You looked up the commands. Every now and then, whenever I add a new command, I'm tempted to say, hey, guys, there's a new command, but I don't want to because that makes it too easy because then you just look it up. Plus, it's in caps. I don't like that. It sticks out. Ugh, I have to fix that.
Oh, fuck off! Aw, oh, damn it! <laughs> you ruined it! You ruined the Lady Demetresk video! How the hell am I supposed to know there's new commands if I don't see them? How the fuck is that even G? <laughs> what I'm asking you to do, Black Hat, is just exclamation point random words. Forever. Forever and ever. Just every day, just guess. Just like, exclamation point, dominoes. Exclamation point, cowboy. Exclamation point, fried cheese curds. Hello, green leader, how are you? I'm losing my mind. I think I finally hit the wall with, uh, with Baja. Bahamut. <laughs> Exclamation point nose. Exclamation point jackass. <laughs> there, now you're getting it. Exclamation point stove. <laughs> oh, God. Let me check the items. So that one was... No, 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 no. That one was your Oron. Triple AP. Painkiller, triple AP. It's, it's only two. Damn it. Random words. I was just telling... I was telling Black Hat Destroyer that I l I'd like to be able to tell you guys, hey, there's a new command you guys can try out. But I feel like that would be, like, ruining the guess of it. Because then immediately, people go to the commands to see where's the new one. And I kind of want you guys to guess it, but how how can you guess a random word? Black Hat makes a very good point. How do you guess a random word? And, and I just kind of wanted you guys to just, like, type in random words with exclamation points until something dinged. Alright, hold up. No one ruined this video. Stupid man thing. Hold up. Perfect. It's all I wanted out of life. Alright, we can end stream now. I'm done. Everyone go home. You've been fighting Macaulay Culkin all night. You have, Green Leader. With your with your hot dog sword. You may not know this, but you've been putting up a hell of a fight with Macaulay Culkin. <laughs> of course I have. That was a different one. Bap. Triple score. Stop giving shit to Waka. What's the stupid man thing? That's uh, Lady Demetresque from Resident Evil Village. Viper doesn't know pop culture. Comet Cactuar. Is that... Is that one? Take it easy on Viper. He was too busy getting laid to play video games or watch movies. Uh... uh Comet Cactuar. Triple AP, done. Ca Comic Tactor, she's got it. She's got the look. Mm. Mm. So now I can upgrade that. Customize. Probably all at the bottom. Ow. I was doing paperwork. That's not. Doing your mom. That's what you're supposed to say. So I need overdrive to AP and then triple overdrive. Triple overdrive needs winning formula. Fuck. How do we get winning formula? Damn gyrating. Yes. Oh, hats off. I missed that one. Now I get to wear the hat I actually wanted to wear. That is facts, though. Viper was a professional pipe layer back in his Navy days. What do you mean he's not anymore? Is that what you mean? Recreational pipe fitter. Or pipe layer, excuse me. Pipe fitter and pipe layer are much different. Topic discussion. Rhinoceros. One of my favorite animals. I like rhinoceroses. Rhinoceroses. That's the big worm. 900k for 15 of them. 
I think, yeah. Okay, I think I remember looking that up and it's not too bad. Because then it's just like, okay, how much money do I have? Not telling me. Not telling me. Where do I... Okay, I have 1.3 million. So, I can just about do one. And then, um... Rhinocerusy. Okay, alright, band. I think you need 30 in order to do the triple AP, so I just have to do, like, two mil. May not be awful. There's just a lot of grinding. Which I'm already still continuing to grind so I can get all the equipment I need. Ah. My favorite is Rocksteady. Oh, okay. He's a different boy, though. I don't need these other triple APs, so that gives me more money right there. It's free real estate. Heartbreaker, triple overdrive. That's 150,000 gold. Some of these things are just fucking nuts. Oh, we got two of those. Get rid of one. Oh, I got two heartbreakers? Get rid of one. Boom, I'm almost up to two million. So this is like simple just grinding of, of equipment is enough to get me a pretty decent amount. See, this one already has Auto Phoenix on it. For Kimari. save here. Uh, rhinoceros is the plural of rhinoceros. I don't believe you. Mr. PhD. Insert Ace Ventura rhino scene. Are you sure that's not a command I don't already have? I'm a doctor, you can trust me. Hey Dan, how are you? Daniel son. Oh god. I'm gonna sneeze. Damn it. This music does not jive with the music of the game. Oh crap, we're able to. Why you gotta kill Riku like that? Why you gotta be like that? Life versus full life. Did you just. just fucking. Waka just murdered Riku. That's not okay. Fuck you. Fuck you twice. Topic of discussion. What do dolphins taste like? Tuna. That's the that's a problem. It's dolphin safe tuna, but then tuna tastes like dolphin, so we can't tell if, whether or not there's dolphin in our tuna because it already tastes like tuna. Uh, I'm going to hail. Damn this fucking painkillers, dude. Fucking piece of shit. Thank God this guy only comes. To hail. I've eaten dolphin, tastes like tuna. Fucking seriously? I was right. I was making shit up. Like, if everything tastes like chicken, then what does chicken taste like? Alright, are you given the Matrix argument? The robots didn't know what Tasty Week tasted like, so everything tastes like chicken. Here's the thing, though. I, I think I had alligator before. And it was, it was kind of spicy, but that was, like, you can't say it tastes like chicken just for spice. Um, forgot where I was going with this. Oh, the texture was different. It may have tasted like chicken, but the texture was much more dense than chicken. Everything doesn't taste like chicken. Giba's taco doesn't taste like chicken. Viper, calm yourself. Beef does not taste like chicken. Very true. Turkey doesn't taste like chicken. Because turkey is shit. Turkey is the shittier version of chicken. 
It doesn't have the fat content to make it taste actually good. Unless you fry it. But, I hold firm on my stance that you could fry a boot and eat it. And it would still taste good. Alligator is so good. I only had it once at, like, a, a, a taste fair. I wasn't against it. Good stuff. Probably have it again. Heard alligator is like swampy chicken. It was a bit more dense. Tastes like fish. I think mine was like a Cajun uh, crocodile or something. It had a little bit of a warmth to it. He's talking about skinny bitches. They don't taste as good. We like our women like we have... Uh, we like our women like we like our Arby's. They have the meats. Uh, I'm so alone. Turkey's okay unless fried. What's wrong with it being fried? If fried, it's better. <sighs> Beaver is okay. I'm trying to sneak around. Hold up. Dummy thick, and the clap from my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. What was that noise? Viper and his beaver. Octopus is delicious. Oh yeah, octopus is fairly common too. Octopi? Turtle was like old tuna. I I don't think I'd like eating turtle. There's no reason to eat turtle. It's not like they're like... They're too slow. What are you gonna do? Oh, I got the turtle. Big achievement. Ostrich and kangaroo is good, but needs to be cooked right. Ostrich, I thought, was very bird-like. It was very chicken-like, because it's a big bird. Turkey is usually dry on Thanksgiving, Rip. That's why you gotta baste it. You gotta be a master baster, Tundiki. Octopies? Octopodus? The hunk of bangaloos. Ton hunk of kugas. I love eel. You mean unagi? I believe that's the correct term for it. I don't think I've had eel. Or unagi. I've stuck a live octopus in my friend's, on my, to my friend's goggles underwater. It was hilarious. For you, perhaps. That, that. Eel unagi sushi is one of my favorites. Eel can be good, but I've had some not great eel. I dark matter. I do not understand the killer fascination with sushi. People who like sushi really fucking like sushi. It's like one of their top foods to get. And I don't see that type of fascination with a food on like any other level. Not with hamburgers or chicken or Pasta, Italian food, Chinese food, any other food. Sushi, they're like, oh my god, I love sushi. I could eat sushi every day. Oh my god, sushi. I'm like, you, I, I say that about tacos and people look at me like I'm fucking crazy. Why? Why the difference? Is it because it's like fancy? The fact is, oh, it's raw fish. It's a raw taco. I don't know. Slight side pointless rant. What do we got? Ostras tasted like it was oily turkey. Kangaroo tasted like beef. Octopodes is dangerous for young, innocent bo boobies. Oh. I've never liked eel. One time it was really horn bony. Oh. I mean, is a pus stuck to your face? Is a puss stuck to your face really a bad thing? Huh. I've had deer heart before. How exactly do you prepare deer heart? I like sushi. I like sushi. Okay, alright. Calm down. Sushi is one of my top foods to get. Sushi is good, but I don't eat it often. I also like sashimi. What exactly is sashimi again? Poopy cannot eat sushi every day. Some people... I don't think it's good to eat sushi every day, isn't it? When octopuses are grabbed off something, they sucker on to the next thing like their lives depended on it. So we just had to ride it out while the octopus freaks out and climbs off. Oh, goody. Uh, sashimi is just raw, thin cu cuts, sans rice. Okay. Egg, crab, fish, cake, tuna, cucumber, carrots, and pickled radish. 
pickled radish is really good. I could just eat pickled radish by itself. At depth, it's hilarious. That's what I hear. You could just manage your panic because you can't go up. Cakes. You gotta do the run. You gotta do the run in order to eat it. Get out, Navy boy. You don't like fish. Goes into the Navy. Hates fish. Can't swim. I'm sure Viper can swim. <coughs> Fuck. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We gotta go. We'll go for two. Maybe? Good God. Uh, now I have to pull my nose. Oh. It's, oh, it feels like shit. Okay. Little kitten sneeze. Shut up! Do you want me to sneeze into the microphone? I don't think that would be good for anyone. Your sneeze is a jump scare. They say it's like a little kitten sneeze. I don't know what the fuck's going on. The swim qualification for becoming a diving instructor was fun. Oh man, I bet. Stove is allergic to fun and was having too much fun in chat. Fun and cheese. Fish cake I got was really good, way better than I expected. The 1,000 yard diver toad. He has a tiny sneeze. I'm not sneezing into the mic. Do you want me to sneeze into the mic? Good God, I'm trying to protect you people, and apparently Viper's like, Harder, Daddy. Which I've never heard anyone say about a sneeze before. Yeah, sneeze into the mic, that's my fetish. Wait, who is a daddy? Uh, Viper is. I once sneezed into a, in a tattoo parlor as my pal was getting one and I got kicked out. Because it was so jarring, everyone jumped. You're a menace to society, Tuniki. You have a dainty little sneeze. Okay, cut that out. <laughs> Sounds weird. All right, now I'm back up to two mils, so I could probably... I still need to get that item for Riku. I need this jackass, this one-eyed jackass, to drop some triple AP three-slot weapons. Or two empty slot weapons, whatever. It is so tiny. Small sneeze, Steve. Giva honks like a goose. Do you want to hear what it's like when I blow my nose? Because that honks like a goose. Again, I'm trying to spare you people. Is that what you call it when she grabbed your ass? She gave me a little uh, honky honky, if you know what I'm saying.
now I'm getting repeats of things that I'm like I don't think it really matters who defeats the the one eye ladies. She doesn't grab my ass. Does she grab your front butt? Blow your nose into the mic and call it ASMR. Okay. I don't have the amaranth tits in order to do that. The day that I can uh, give Amaranth a run for her money, I'll do ASMR. Whatever you boys want. Where the fuck was I? Oh, right, I wanted to see how much uh, dark matter I had. 88! We're almost there. No, no. Talk to this guy. Fight monsters. She's weirdly strong, though. You talk about this already. Let us be the judge. Show Bob's. Please, no. Steve just have to wear Skippy outfit and sit by a pool. I don't have a pool. It's not the temperature for pools. I live in the Midwest. There are no pools. It's not pool weather yet. Get a kiddie pool? No. It's gross. Hot tub stream coming from Steve. Oh god, no. 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 I tried to wrestle her once and had to actually go all in. What? Viper, what do you mean by go all in? You're saying you were fully inserted? That's not right. That's not okay. She lost, but it was shockingly difficult. Well, of course she lost. She went all in. And then it fell in? <laughs> Just fell in and out and in again. Like, actually use all the muscle. We weren't going there. And here we are. Hot dogs. Yes, thank you. Hot dogs. Hot dog splash. Their accuracy is so high they can actually... Okay. Die now. She had to give up because you're... <laughs> what... What was that from? Was that from... Beavis and Butthead or something? They say, like, when you get into a fight with somebody, just say, Oh my god, you're giving me a boner! And then they will, they'll leave you alone. You're giving me an erection! Oh god, gross! And then you can win. Holy fucking jeez, give me the thing that I want. So which big worm do I have to, um, bribe? Is it the one from the sands? From the desert? Put that thing away. Fubi, I'm confused. You're not the only one. Let me help you hide that thing. Just put it in here. Okay, Viper's writing erotica again. This is inappropriate for Fubi. The Foobs. Um, where the heck am I? Where's the... Sandworm. The Sandworm? I saved, so we'll see. Oh, I'm ambushed, hooray. Missed. Nice job, dingus. 
Okay, so bribe. And we have to do 900,000. So let's see what happens. Wow. Greedy fucker. Winning formula, 15. There we go. What did I need willing to winning formula again? Uh, to customize... Green leader, you naughty boy. You've done that before. You've played that video and you've gone, I did not know it was going to do that. Like nine times out of ten, the video that's going to be posted has some sort of anime booba in it. Or cheese. There, there, there's your gamble. It's either cheese or booba. Uh, fight monster. I guess I can bet it. What the fuck? Or Jontron, I guess. Jontron needs to make more videos. Ow. So basically, two million. If you have two million dollars, you can get the winning form. Ah! It was only twelve instead of fifteen. Fucking cheap ass worm fucker. Yes, he is a worm fucker. Fucker of worms. What was I looking for? What do I need? Overdrive? Something? No. What I was looking for. I have 90 of those now. Almost done on that. What am I looking for? Why, why am I not seeing the AP stuff? Am I losing my fucking mind here? Break HP? No, no, I was looking for the uh, overdrive or triple triple AP. Oh, it's on weapon. Thank you. That's why. Thank you. Good God. Thank you. Thank you staring at it going, why? Why won't it make sense? So yeah, you need 30 in order to, to add the triple overdrive. Well, I have that ready. The double overdrive, that's ready. Shit. I just want to get... I want, I want it to be done on Riku. The other ones I can work on. It ran away. Oh, you bribed it. That just sounds gross, Steve. I mean, it is. Wormfucker. Uh, bring it to me, uh, God bless Port. <laughs> yeah. Without you and Chocobos, Dove would be lost. Yes, yes. Bless this Bort. <laughs> Alright, old man. Give me the gear. And give it to me raw. There's a line from Rings of Power that the dwarf said. Give me the meat, give it to me raw. That's great writing right there. Fantastic writing. Stupendous. Wonderful. Riku Matt stats when? When I get a fucking item that has triple AP and two empty slots. I will slap that on Riku like it's my fucking job and we will go across the grid and she will get maxed. TF out. Into Elrond, no less. Oh, okay. did you actually... You didn't watch it, did you? You just... You saw that scene? That was an Elrond. In no world on any planet was that Elrond. 
Or that was Gal Galadriel, or... None of that. None of that was any of Tolkien's work. It's a farce. Two more Dark Matter. We're getting there. Either... I mean, that's the cool thing about what we're doing. Or what I'm doing. Which is whatever. You're watching and mocking me. Um, the grind still helps on multiple levels. I'm grinding for equipment. Or I'm trying to farm the equipment that I need. While I'm also farming the item that I need for Ribbon for other characters, too. So, it just all works out. It's a big circle. Fuck no, just saw that scene. I don't know why anyone would waste their time watching that piece of shit show. It's so bad. He called the slut slots. Oops. Friday Night Tights like to play that clip, yeah. Yeah, along with the, you flick too hard, damn it! From Thor, Love and Thunder, which is also a very bad, bad product. <sighs> Colonel. I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dummy thick, and the clap for my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. What was that noise? I was watching the Little Platoon's breakdown of Quantum Mania. I think I got about halfway through it because, like, it's over an hour, and uh, some of the just shit writing that's involved in Quantum Mania, I absolutely fucking hate. More dark matter. We're getting there. I just can't understand why people are watching Quantum Mania, seeing this crap happening in front of them, and be like, "I I had fun." It's like it doesn't make any fucking sense. It's terribly written. Holy shit! Moist worms are fun. Okay, get out. Back to your cage. Oh my god, stop giving me wep armors. I need I need weapons. Some people are brain dead. Or bots. Or just shills. Because that's what you see a lot of on, on the internet. There, there's like people trying to defend this new TMNT product show. Another two dark matter. We're almost there. What do we have? Items? 96. Holy shit. Do we need full 99 or do we need 90? I'll check. But here is Kang. Don't ask questions. Yeah. And they even revealed him like shittily. I'm... My expectations for Guardians is actually in the fucking toilet. I think Marvel's going to screw that up, too, even though James Gunn kind of, like, took control of it. Oh, boy. It's not even good, Kang. The trailer looked half-decent until we saw April. Not even then. Even before then, I didn't care for it, because the turtles sound like fucking babies. They even look like fucking babies, like the most infantile version of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles we've ever seen. Mikey has braces, for some reason. And, um, they still sound, not, not sound, they still act like they're kind of incompetent in what they do. When the article online about it was saying they've been doing this for quite some time, so they're used to being heroes. No, they still look like they dick around and they're stabbing each other with their weapons. That's not, that's not what people who are seasoned in doing hero stuff do. You can still make mistakes, sure. But you can't, like, flip on a banana peel and fall on your ass when you're supposed to be fucking ninjas. Again, the live-action original movie is the best turtles we will ever get. Wasn't the original April Black? No. No, she was not. These Wokesters' arguments are dumb. They don't read comics. They've never probably touched a comic before. A turtle comic. And if they do, if they aren't dumb, they're intentionally lying. Just to, like, skew perceptions and to act like, oh, it's just the, you know, they're the butthurt troll fan... No. It's, it's just, it's blatantly false. It'll be funny to watch it flop, though. Yep. Well, here's the thing. It'll flop, but then... Overload. Is that what I need? No. It'll flop, but people will immediately do the cover attack. Oh, that's the one I need for him. Got triple AP for, um... 
Oron. So we got Oron. Alright, so we got Orons as well. There, that painkiller, okay. And then go back into items. So I can... No, no, don't sort. How do I go back into items? How, how have I fucked this up so much? How do I go... I've lost my mind. How the fuck do I get into equipment? 96. Shit, shit. Customize... What do I need for a ribbon? It's all the way at the bottom, I know. And flop it will. Floppy floppy. Did you see Angry Joe's reaction to people's criticism of the new April O'Neil? I did. And then Eric July took him to fucking school. To which he backed off of it and was like, I wasn't talking about you. I wasn't I wasn't talking about you. Then who were you talking about? Just a general, th these people over here who don't know any. Yeah, it has to be actually 99 to max that out. Damn it. He implied that anyone who didn't like the race swapping was racist. Typical. Not just that. That for some reason, that if you just wanted Rachel to be sexy or something that made you also... You know... Somebody attracted to minors. But April has usually been an adult in most of these stories. If not adult, she was the oldest of all the turtles. She was she was old. Er. Whatever. But only with the Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The CG one, and then the one right after that where they originally turned April black with a green glowing baseball bat. Was she of a younger age? So they're already getting stupidly brainwashed thinking, April's a young teenager. No, she's not. She's only recently been that, and it's a terrible fucking choice. The reason they made her young in the, the, the Nickelodeon CG move, uh, show was to, like, make it some sort of romance option for the turtles. Don't do that. Don't. Don't do that. No interspecies relationship with the turtles. Full stop. Shut the fuck up. It's creepy and weird. But then he implied that anyone who that didn't like that she was fat and ugly are basically fans of the playground. Right. He used Melanie Max tweet as an example of that. Yeah, and then Eric July took him to fucking school. Reamed him over the fucking coals. Oh, the whole internet kind of rose up against him too. Because this hasn't been the first time that... Oh my god, we're about to get ribbon. This hasn't been the first time that uh, he's had some bad takes. Because somebody was even called... I only need one more? Are you shitting me? Um, one person was already kind of making fun of him by saying, as soon as this movie starts to flop, you'll you'll change. And you'll say, oh, it's awful, it's terrible, I hate it. Like, he just sways to whatever he thinks is going to be the most popular response for things. Uh, is there any girl turtles? They're recently... Well, te I mean, depends. They did add one... In one show that was live action, that was based off of, uh, I think Bandai was in court, uh, control of that one. It was uh, like Power Rangers. That was Venus de Milo, was the name of that female turtle. But there's another female turtle in the comic books. She's got a yellow bandana. I think her name is Jen. She got like a blood transfusion from one of the turtles, and that's what turned her into it. It's very similar to She-Hulk, which a lot of the turtles' lore is basically like kind of making fun of the Marvel Universe. Like, the ooze is the chemical that hits Matt Murdock's eyes and makes him blind. It's the same chemical. So there is some, like, connections there. There was one in the one of live-action movies. Or, the live-action... It, it was a TV show, I think. A series. We don't really talk about that one, I guess. That's bestiality, they, uh, what you're talking about. Right. And that's why I'm saying no to that. Don't do that. Aqua, I think, was it? What? Aqua? It's Venus. 
Venus de Milo. It fits with the the other Leonardo, Raphael. Da, da, da. Yeah, it was Venus. Basically a female Leo. Bad writing. Fubi liked Donatello. I like Donatello as well. He's one of my favorite turtles. It's either Donatello or Raph. Raphael. April is a human f female. Yes. Wrong answer, Foobs. Raphael is the best. Uh, I know I watch the turtles now. The, the rest of that bullshit about comics, no clue. Yeah, the comics kind of went off. Like, they've, they've been going on for a while now. Some stories really good. I had the old, like, Archie comics. Quite a few of the Archie comics. Those are pretty good. Uh, but possibly the worst thing about it is, like, it's... It's Seth Rogen being involved in it. That's the worst part. And I guess they interviewed him recently about uh, Green Hornet. Remember Green Hornet? And he was making some comments about, and he may have a point, talking about how the critics kind of bashed on it so hard that it made him feel pretty bad. I'm like, well, it was a bad movie, guy. But he said that, you know, like average average viewers like you and I, who aren't, we aren't professional critics, are the ones that kind of like ruined it for everyone because we, you know, ran our mouths and said we hated it. But everyone's entitled to their opinion. Everyone's entitled to their voice. He's just upset that the fact that we can go take to the internet and write it, and if we have, like, a following, it can be influential to other people's opinions of the thing. Seth is a jackass. Among many other things that he is, yes. <laughs> yeah, do the thing. I did the thing. Leave me alone. I do not recall Green Hornet. Don't. Don't do it. It's a bad movie. Green Hornet wasn't horrible, but it wasn't good at all. It was that trope of, like, let's turn the hero into a schlubby turd who's incapable. We don't want to see that. I want to see somebody... We're done. Ribbon. We're done. I'm shutting down the stream. We're done. Everyone go home. Who should I give Ribbon to? I'm thinking Tidus. Put it on his Phoenix shield right here. Auto Phoenix, Auto Haste, Auto Protect, and Ribbon. How's that sound? Damn, guess he'll have to cry into his millions of dollars. So sad. Right. Like, you're really gonna run... Ah, oh, that thing I created, no one liked. You still made money. People paid you to do it. He will cry into his pile of cash and Steve will cry into his hats. True story. Ribbon, let's fucking go. Waka? It's either going to be Tidus or Waka. Fubi not know. What do you guys think? I got Ribbon. Let's look at their equipment. Okay. Okay. There we go. So, Waka and Tidus are set up exactly the same. Yuna still needs, like, another one. I'm not sure if I need want to put Protect on her or the HP part. But if I put Ribbon on her, she won't benefit from, like, the underwater battles. Can do a poll, yeah. Um, Waka or titties? <laughs> All right, what do you guys think? What are you gonna put on for the other guys? I don't know, ribbon. I might I might work up to getting ribbon again with how long this is taking me. HP break on Yuna seems awesome since it carries over to Aeons. That's a good point. That would work quite better than Protect, I think. Because I don't think it carries Protect doesn't carry over to the Aeons. Much like haste, auto haste doesn't carry over to the Aeons. It's looking like titties. Titties with three boats. But what else on Yuna? Uh, yeah, ribbon or stone proof, depending. Yeah. Oh god, it's tied. Don't, don't. Oh, Waka. Waka edging it out. Alright, we're putting it on Waka. 
I might end up getting Ribbon again. Well, I'm certainly going... I can get Ribbon again easy, just by killing all the monsters. But anyway, customize. Oh, crap, where is it? Yeah, Miracle Comeback. There we go. Damn you all. It was mostly me. And Viper doesn't even know what we're talking about. I can get Rippin' again. It's not It's not going to hurt. I can get at least two. Because I haven't gotten all the monsters to give me instant 99 Dark Matter yet. You spent your cheesy boys on the pole. Yes, yes you can. Boom. So... Waka's done with his armor. I'm not doing any more. So, Yuna, though. Oh God, where's her item? Too far. Oomph, I say. Facts. There we go, Phoenix Rain. I need uh, HP. And that one's what? The Wings to Discovery. Fuck, that's why. If I can do that on one... If I can do that on one, that might be decent enough. But then, of course, I'm going to have to go this, through the sphere grid and give her every single HP node I can possibly get. Stupid man thing. Okay. Um... Oh god, that's right. That's what I was still grinding on here. Hang on, back out. Buy weapons. We're gonna sell. Sell, sell, sell. You have to ask the Magic 8 Ball a question. It just responds. It doesn't know what you're gonna ask it. Steve into hats. Signs point to yes. Hats point to yes. So I still need... I still need... Riku's... Crap. Well, at least I have ribbon. Doing all of that, I got ribbon. So... cheese on the pizza is so fucking needed. I love it so much. There are there are times it's like, what are you even doing? You put extra cheese on a pizza, it's so brilliant. It's so good. I want it piled high. Oh, did I miss? How was, how was the ribbon a mistake? I didn't say it was. Well, I went at video games. <laughs> and it said yes. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. I used to put extra cheese on every pizza I made. Where? Like at, at the at the place you worked? That's technically theft, Viper. Uh, one time I got a complaint that there was simply too much cheese on the customer's pizza. I only know how to respond to that with anger and violence. Too much cheese on my pizza? Unless they're lactose intolerant, in which case you shouldn't be eating a pizza anyway. Wow, that ribbon really saved the day for Waka. Alright, how much money do I have now? Working my way up. So, currently... I have a decent enough team that we can probably tackle... Baja. Now that I have, now that I have one ribbon, at least. Because that was the thing that was holding me back. We can try, we can try doing that. Tackle Baja one more time. Hello there. Hello there, one guitar guy. How are you? Uh, not Riku Titus. There we go. And we'll check the equipment, making sure everything's okay there. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Okay. 
How many... What wings to discover do I need? How do I get wins, wings to discovery again? Damn it, I had to keep looking this up. Oh, Malboros. Shit. And how many is needed for um, HP limit break? That's the, that's the thing. FFX HP limit break. Uh, remember me telling me about the boss that would grab my ass and said it's only sexual harassment if you don't want to fuck? She was the manager. She shoved sh cheese down your pants, too. Jesus, mother of God, what have you done? What? I saw your stats and nearly died. That's amazing. Oh, hang on. Whoops, that's a pause. Yeah, it's been a bit, hasn't it? Yeah, we got, we got almost full max stats. Yesterday I was able to uh, get magic, accuracy, evasion, and agility up. That was... Doable, you just need to put time into it. Luck... Luck is a chore. So, if I do end up doing that, that's gonna be a pain. But yeah, Titus, Yuna, Waka. They got their stats. I've been trying to get Riku's triple AP item to drop from one eye, so that way I can max out her sphere grid and get her up and ready to go for some of the water battles that I know are coming up in the, in the monster sphere grid. But I need it to drop. I got one to drop for Auron, I got one to drop for Lulu. So now all I'm missing is Riku and Kamari. So there. A little extra cheese wasn't the problem. You were giving her a little extra cheese. If you know what I'm saying. Okay, I need 30 of the rare Wings to Discovery items. It raises the HP cap from 9 to okay. H Break HP limit is the second most dominant ability for an armor behind Ribbon. The armor with HP uh, break HP limit becomes the Genji shield for Titus, Genji bracer for Ar Arcane ring for Yuna, Super goalie for Waka, Genji. Oh, so I can I can probably get it, an HP limit break item, and then add on Auto Phoenix and Auto Haste would possibly be easier than trying to get to craft the uh, that break. Is HP limit break? Oh, break MP limit. Break HP limit. Arcane ring. I don't want to know what it looks like. I want to know where you can get it, dingus. Hmm. It was picking the pubes out of the cheese she crammed down your pants. She got a little less her pepperoni, and sometimes, if from behind, summer sausage. Shameful. Um, MP limit is trash. Really, there's I don't think there's a single fight that goes on long enough. Plus, you don't even use magic because everything is fucking immune to everything. What do you... Well, you use it for, like, quick hits and stuff, but at that point, you all you need is the 999. Alright, so... Uh, I'm, uh, I only need one. Um, wings. Damn it. I had this. Hang on. Customize. Break HP limit. He's got the break HP limit on his. Damn it. Do I have... Hang on. Do I have break HP limit on him? Like, damage limit. Nope. I don't. Damn it. I have it on fucking Tidus' crap. Ah. Uh, okay. So... How many do I need to craft? I think it said 30? I have 28. Do I only need like a little bit? If that's the case, I can craft one of these at least. Yeah, 30 of Wings to Discovery. Maybe I'll do that. Okay. So... Shit. I was just looking at that. How much do I need to bribe? Get four wings from Mal regular Malboros for 550. How much money do I have? Oh my god. Well, I have enough. I only need four. It's gonna pretty much bankrupt me. Do it. Don't think. Just do it. Okay. 
I need to find a, I need to encounter a regular Malboro though. But that's in the monster thing. I can do that. Five fifty. I'm not. It's not that I'm not trying to think. I'm trying to do it right. Five fifty k. Okay. Fight monsters. Um. Calm lands. Malboro. Yes. Yeah, the big one does, but I'm not going for the big one because that's way too fucking expensive and I don't need that. I just need, like, two. So I'll do that. I, I just saved two, so I can always go back. And undo that. I don't think he's putting HP break on anyone else. No. Nope. Just put, putting it on Yuna. That's it. Instead of protect, I'm giving her HP. And off he did fuck. What did it say online? You get four. I got two. The game is asshole. Yeah, right. There. Done. Christ. So then the only thing she needs is, like, uh, uh, to remove stone or put ribbon on her. So what's hers? She's at 19,875 health. Ooh. Ooh. What does that make her aeons, then? Can I check those out? Ho, 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 ho. Look at that. She said almost at 50k. I actually don't think it transferred over. I think... Damn it. Yeah, I don't think it transferred over because I think it already does. It already transferred over. Whatever you get on the grid transfers over. They can get more health. They don't need the limit break. So it just helps you to have more. So basically now I just need to get HP up for all, all the crap she has. Yeah, it, it looks the same. It was the same as it was before. Like Valifor only had like 13k... So the health benefits were already there from what I put into the grid. But now Yuna gets more HP, so that way she's not going to get ganked as easily. Um, so if I go to the sphere grid, as I am currently doing, use... How many HP spheres do I have? I think I have a few. I have five. I can crank her up a bit more, but I don't know where I want to do that at. Like, everything up here is already taken. There's one up there. I can, put, I can go up there. Because the rest are going to be, uh... Like, HP. Maybe I'll go all the way to the right here. Oops, oops, oops. Uh, no. Move, move. I got five. What the fuck? Oh, I gotta go all the way over here. So let's go over here. I have five. One, two, three, four, five. I can do that. Who do I get? Crap. Who do I get those from that I can mine? HP sphere. Drops from Lord Ochu, Left Fin, Ironclad. That doesn't seem that hard to get. Best method, defeat Ironclad in the Monster Arena. So use HP Sphere. Which gives me, what, 300. Holy shit. that one, damn it. Oh well. God, it's gonna take a lot of HP nodes to get her maxed out.
Oops. I gotta put down the HP sphere first. God damn it. Oh, okay, good. It went over I wanted to get over at 20k, so she's over 20k now. Okay. Show me Ironclad. Where's Ironclad? Oh god, where is Ironclad? Everything's a pain. Species. Ironclad, Ironclad, Ironclad. Oh shit. What do I need to get Ironclad? Iron Giant, Thunder Plains. How many? Capturing three of each. Okay, Iron Giant got Gemini Club, Inside Sin. Oh shit. Gemini Club. I got those. Sword. I got. Yeah. I have them. Did I not see the Species Conquest? Am I blind? Ironclad, Monster Arena, Species Conquest. Species Conquest? Or is he over here? Ironclad? No. Yeah, he's supposed to be over here. Why isn't he? Three of each Iron Giant type fiend, which includes three. Okay. I did. I put five, eight, and eight. Don't know what you want from me. Yeah, he's supposed to be down here. Before Tank It is who? Naga Elemental. That's the one there. But he should be right here. Oh, Lord. Well, anyway. That's that's the thing I'm doing now. I guess I'll do that with uh, Yuna. I'll max out her HP. Can't buy Clear Spheres yet, because I haven't maxed anything out there. All right, back to uh, the airship. Let's tackle Baja. Let's see what happens. Your count. One more last shot before the end of the night. Here we go. Don't want to go too terribly late tonight. I blew up Kamari. You, you guys can't yell at me anymore. Them's the rules. Thank you, Green Leader. I believe. <sighs> so what now? We're gonna beat a dragon. Or attempt to, anyway. But he won't be able to, uh... Oh my god, fuck off. Why is this still here? The puzzle shouldn't be here anymore. We're done. We did all of it. Um, he shouldn't be able to petrify the entire group because uh, Waka will have the ribbon on. So. There we go. He won't be able to fuck off? Yes. Correct. And off we go. I said off we go. I think you need 10 of each of the giants for it to unlock. Yeah, uh, uh, this guide says three of each, and I clearly have more than that, so I guess I'll find that out some other day. Every single time I think I'm like getting close to the end, there's something else. I can at least max out the grid for Yuna by filling all the other spare spheres with HP so that way she can get as close to 99k as possible. What was I gonna do? Oh, right. So we do auto life first. So we don't die. Dark Bahamut! Hello, Silent. Welcome. Alright, everyone's good on that front. Alright. Let's see. Oh, right. Aim. One. Two. 
two, three, four, five, and hopefully I don't die. Shit, TD. Teedles! Teedles didn't, didn't die. Here, heal thyself. All right. Oh, what's that you say? Attack reels? Oh, did I change it so that they deal damage? I forget. Whatever. Because he doesn't have a keyblade, yeah. How many times do you have to beat him? Once. He's got four million health. Alright. What can I do with you? Cricket? Oh, he doesn't immediately rip, uh, attack back. Okay. And this is the game now. It's just quick hit. Until... Until Oblivion. So they build on damage, right? Yeah, okay, so that's still stuck up. I think it's so cool how he stands like a bouncer outside a nightclub. Yeah, he's got a, it's a great look. It's a good one of the one of the better versions of Bahamut. But he just nuked Yuna. Boy, this game is just great. <laughs> he he fucking nuked Yuna. So quick too. Just froze her and then gone. Wait, is his is his auto life gone? Petrify removes your auto life? Oh, I guess it it would. Holy Christ. And now we're in recovery mode. We're trying to like make sure we have enough health. And then that happens. At least we have auto-haste. Back I lost Yuna, oh my god. His ult is ready, we're going to die. Thank god I have auto-life on, oh, here we go. I think, I think, I think, this might be it. Now, in this particular instance, yes, you do absolutely need, you, there's no, there's no half-assing it. You do need something to stop you from being petrified. Because as soon as you're petrified, he slaps you and then you're nuked. You're gone. The Mega Flare thing is a non-issue if we have multiple characters up because then they can do Auto Phoenix. That's fine. So, yeah, Baja is the one that you need uh, something to prevent petrification. You can't just have one person and then heal the others. Stupid man thing! Ugh. Even when you have Ribbon or Stoneproof, you still have to be careful to count your hits so that he doesn't do Impulse and Mega Flare back-to-back. -back. 
Ah, okay. Okay. Alright. Well, it's looking like I'm going to have to look into a couple of guides and make sure, you know, I'm still doing the right thing. I still think it's a good idea to... I mean, if Yuna doesn't get slapped, she can at least have enough HP that she can withstand that attack. Um, the Aeons... Yeah, the Aeons get a little bit more HP for, for stuff. If we can max out them, that'll be very helpful. She getting nuked like that was a pain in the ass. Um, so either... So she has break HP limit. Either I give her stone proof. What other what other aeons give uh, status effects? Like what other status effects am I looking out for? Because most guides are like, stop petrification from happening. No, none of them are like, oh, worried about poison or confusion or stuff like that. Those those seem like ones you can easily get rid of. They're not ones that kill you outright. Because petrification is fucking broken in this game once you get hit with it. It's called get a new strat. I, I am. I'm doing that right now. And wait until dark anima. Dark anima, more like. The remaining dark ands are just all status effect nightmares. Give her a ribbon. Okay. I can do that. Because all I need to do... Since I have to... I think I think that's what I'll do tomorrow. All right, give me a sec. Let's go back to um, the calm lands. We're going monster arena here. That's that's the next thing. So basically, we're gonna we're gonna max out the monster arena. He's gonna give me 99 red balloons, or words for boobs, and we're gonna use that to make another ribbon for Yuna. Stone proof is absolutely needed if you don't have ribbon. The rest of the status effects you just have issue now a remedy. Right. But I'm curious, like, I'm I'm wanting to know who can I put, who can I chance putting ribbon on because I'm not going to grind out another fucking ribbon after this. This, I, I mean, I might. I might be able to passively and get close enough, but holy shit. Um. So here's my, here's my logic on this. I don't want to end up in a... I want to be able to fight the monsters in the monster arena. Well, some are underwater. Well, if I give Ribbon to Waka, that'll help. I don't know I don't know if the monsters in the monster arena are have a lot of status effects. We know the Dark Aeons do, but I don't know the deal with the, the monsters in there. Yuna can't participate in there, so I'd be wasting my time if I gave her a, a, a Ribbon just for that. But Waka has a Ribbon, so he should be able to do what he needs to there. It's not like you have other any other games to play. Right. Um, my worry is, though, is if, like, Waka needs more health and I need to get rid of Auto Protect to put in more health for that, but... Again, then I'd have to go through the fucking grid to max out his health. I don't... Ugh. Isn't there only one under, uh, uh, underwater monster arena boss? There might be. There might be. I just... I worry about that one. I need... So I guess I need Riku for that one specific boss, and you and I can use for everything else. So, my A team, as it exists now, is Titus, Yuna, Waka. So, he's got Ribbon, so she's either gonna... I'm gonna need Ribbon on somebody else. We're thinking Ribbon on Yuna, it sounds like. Shinryu is the only one I can think of that, and it stones you. Okay. Which, that one's... If that's all it does, then you can get stone proof. That'll fix that. Um, so then I can put I can put stone proof on Waka. Ah, Titus. Waka is fine. Titus will get stone proof. Yuna will get the other ribbon, and I think we'll be good. Shinryu in this game. Yes, I think I already have Shinryu unlocked. Let me check. Yep. There's Shinryu. Let's fight him. Oh god, we got ambushed. Oh god, we're dead. He just slapped Riku from existence. How much HP does this bitch have? What else do you recommend minus stone proof? I think that's the only one that they really recommend. How 
much health does Shinryu have? Two million HP. Come and steal. Come and drop wings to discovery. It drops wings to discovery or dark matter. Is this the guy where you can cast Phoenix? I don't think so. I think it's this is him when he's alive. Yeah, not the same boss. Did I fucking do anything to him? I didn't even see it. Suck my balls. There we go. Oh my god. With 99s. This guy might be doable without Riku. I might be able to kill him right now without Riku. Oh boy. Ow. Oh, that's right, though. If he casts, if he casts stone, if he casts uh, petri petrify, I'll drop like a rock and just die. I think that's what he actually did to uh, to Riku. Is this is this going to be a gum? Uh, this is going to become another uh, Waka only game. This is going to be funny. Shining. What is that? Nothing. Nothing is what that is. Problem is, we're not dealing enough damage in order to build the overdrive as much. And we're not taking enough damage, I think, to qualify for a uh, comrade. This is just going to take a while, I guess. Ribbon won't be needed for pendant. Sounds awful. How will we win, then? Have another set of armor? Oh, god. I'm not fucking doing that. Done. Wow, the one I was worried about. Done. Didn't even need Riku. Bye, Riku. Wings to Discovery. That, there's the two I needed. I could have saved money. Fuck. Shit. What's Curative Shield? What does that give me? Auto Med. I need that. That's hilarious. That was that was funny. Shinryu is the sound Steve makes when he poops. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So I guess I guess the thing now is just we want Bahamut. So going to clear out the monster arena so that we we can get ribbon for Yuna and then um put Stoneproof on Titus. In which case, I could probably do that right now. Um, da -da 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 -da. Stoneproof, 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 stoneproof. Am I blind? Stone Ward Stormproof. There we go. Petrify Grenade, which I have a shit ton of. A cheese poop instead of a cheesy poof? Right. There we go. Stoneproof. So he's set and good to go for the next battle there. And then we'll max out that. 
so that way we can get all the gear that we need, because I want to max out Yuna's HP as much as I can. I got plenty of spheres for Yuna to work with, so I can max out her stuff, maybe get her 50k, instead of, instead of, uh, like, double her, double HP pretty well. We'll see. But yeah, that'll be, that'll be what I'll do tomorrow. Oh my god, get out of my way, old man. I'll do that tomorrow. It'll be Monster Arena, max out the Monster Arena, get Yuna Ribbon, and then we'll be good to, like, finally start tackling Baja. Then at that point, it won't be, like, about petrification. It'll be about balancing out his attack with Mega Flare. And hopefully I can throw out some summons to have them take the heat. We'll see. But yeah, that'll do it for today, since that's, that's four hours. Holy shit. Okay. Still, still a long stream, despite me wanting to not do that long of a stream. Who's ooping a boot? We have... Not a lot of people. We have Kennel. Playing Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Yeah, uh, thank you for joining, Green Leader. Thank you for stopping by. Yes, it's over already. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm glad that uh, you still want me to keep going, Fubi. But it's it's one in the morning here. I need to I need to stop and start getting ready for bed. You guys are game nerds. It's adorable. Oh, thank you. Uh, so now you have Dark Baja, Anima, Penance. Who else? That's pretty much it. Deg. What? Deglamong. Who, who, who that? I'm up for, okay, sure. As long as they don't make me do any math. Deglamong. What are they playing? The Isle? What is that? It says racing BMS, BMX ra retro? What? A.K.A. Megalodong. Deglamong. Alright, sure. Why not? I'm gonna go watch Dane cook. That sounds like awful. Uh, Deglamong is one of Badical's mods. Oh, cool! Okay! There's the connection. Sure, no problem. Easy peasy. He's playing Final Fantasy X. I am. Are you in the wrong chat? What's going on? Whatever, we're getting the raid going. Let's go watch Dane cook after the raid. Awful. Awful choice. Awful taste. Well, let's go over and, and give uh, Deglamong our, our love and attention for this raid. Thank you so much for watching. And sp uh, special shout outs go to Black Hat Destroyer for the cheers and the bits. For Gold Eagle, Gina, for the cheers and the bits. Oh, Dane Cook is playing Final Fantasy X? That's weird. Megalodon. We'll be back again tomorrow with more Final Fantasy X. 10. Final Fantasy 10. <laughs> and uh, maxing out the monster arena, and then we have we have just those those dark aeons to fight. We're pretty much squared away on our equipment. I don't really care about maxing out Riku anymore, I guess. And we'll just finish off these dark aeons and be done with it. Easy peasy. Apparently he games now. Didn't he get married to like a really young woman? Like half his age or a quarter of his age? Something kind of, kind of, kind of sus. I don't know. Okay. Maybe I don't know. But yeah, that's it for me for tonight. Uh, have a good night, everyone. And I will see you guys either tomorrow or some other time. Have a good night. Oh god, we only have eight minutes. Black Hat, it's too late! Ah!